How about now? How are we go? How are we doing? Oh, all right, all right, all right. There we go. There we go. Oh, I knew it. I knew it, guys. Hang on. Let me let me get all the windows closed that are like me looking at myself or listening to myself. Okay, we're back. We're off to a fiery hot start. Ah, oh, gosh. The, yes, I saw all your guys' messages. Thank you for uh, letting me let me know. It's uh, it's a great start to a stream, and just have uh, have myself cut off the first two full minutes. What is it? Three minutes? Okay, it's only been three minutes. That's not too bad. We were. We were offline for a little bit. I was saying I didn't want to play the game yet because I wanted to be reacquainted with you guys. So I started talking and then uh, all hell broke loose. So, how we doing? I did not point, put my points into tech. Yeah, exactly. Let's see. Okay, let me get my, my bearings. I, I literally was already like, I'm not even kidding, two minutes before this, I was like, I'm actually like kind of nervous because I haven't done this in a second. And uh, I was like, I don't know. All right, well, I have everything set up, so we're good to go. And then like, literally two seconds in, it's just like, well, fuck me, it's, this is over. Great. Jack has become full-timer. Yes, I know, it's crazy. I if, if of, of, For those of you who have watched the stream, that's like been my biggest thing. It's like, I feel like I've mentioned that every time I stream, it's like, hey, I can only play for a couple hours because I got a real job in the morning. The, um, but yeah, it's it's officially out. And that's why I didn't want to jump right into playing the game. Um, but uh, yeah, thanks for joining guys. There's like so many of you already, it's fucking crazy. What was my previous job? I was a graphic designer. Luigi, go watch the damn video. It's called Full Time. It looks like an indie short film on accident, but uh, it's just about me quitting my job to be a full-time YouTuber. <laughs> BW for leaving the real job. Yeah, and, it, and and I was being serious in the video. I, I do say that I'm like scared and nervous about it. That is true, um, but uh, but I'm super excited. It's it's just it's just scary because it's like it's all on you now. It's not. It's not like, I don't know. It's it's not early by any means. It's just it's just doing it for real is one thing. I'm also very excited. Uh, in that video at the top or the the top comment, the pinned comment that I put on there um, is the fact that the next video will be on Cyberpunk. So I'm very excited about that. Oh shit! You guys have been donating. Sorry. Yo, let me let me get those. Um, and we'll talk about Cyberpunk. Like, obviously, it's gonna be the whole fucking game that we're playing. CDN one zero two five has become a member. Thank you so much. Too much waifu has become a member. Thank you. Vase Vasians has donated five dollars five dollars through the super chat. Um, what's going on, Jack? What are your general thoughts on the game so far? I think uh, the game's AI can feel extremely uh, insipid sometimes, <sighs> dude. The science with with my new build that I did exclusively for the Phantom Liberty DLC, it's it's a little ridiculous how much I'm cutting through people and I'm playing on hard. But we'll talk about that in a second. I I will definitely talk about how I feel about the game. I will get to that. Um, La Baguette donated a European crisp European five dollars. Hijack, how's the game? Love your videos, mate. We'll get into that. Thank you so much. Puffy Feet donated a Nokia twenty phone. Um, I hope you sleep well. Thank you. I have been. I've been sleeping a little too much, if I'm being honest. Love you too, Chef Jack. Thank you, Puffy Feet. Oh, you did it three times. All no 20s. Or four times. Jeez. The way I have this set up, this thing stinks. My OBS, like, uh, what do you call this? Strategy. I'm gonna put you right here in front of my face and in front of the concurrent viewers number because that is intimidating. Imagining 250 people over my shoulder playing a video game. I'm not gonna picture that right now. The um, but I'm grateful. I'm grateful that you're all here. <laughs> oh, yo, wait, wait, wait. I'm reading old. <laughs> I'm reading old donations. Those aren't even new. That's hilarious. Okay. Lumper donated three dollars to the super chat. Thank you so much, and said, and another three, and said, "Hi Jack, hope you're uh, staying hydrated. Great, thank you. There we go. Now we're good. Um, and then I think 
we are good there, good there. I think I'm gonna look at the YouTube's chat and not... Okay, so maybe I can do this. Let me switch around these guys. Sorry, I know that you're not really seeing anything right now, but my big nose, but we'll get right into that. Not the nose. There we go. So I'm gonna watch that. That's good. Yeah, that's, all right, so my information's right here. My video's right here. My laboratory is back there. Good. Okay. Have a good stream. Thank you so much. My boyfriend loves you. That's what they all say. <laughs> the, um, <laughs> uh, any girls? No girls have said they're a fan of the chat. I've met a couple of you in person now, and I can't tell you it is the coolest feeling ever. I was at the Jaguars game with just my girlfriend. Uh, I was supposed to go with a bunch of friends, and boy, do I wish I was with more friends when I had a fan come up to me, and I could be like, look, see, it's real. <laughs> the, uh, but, uh, yeah, he was, he was super nice. I didn't get his name because I was like in the middle of talking to somebody I was already meeting and yada yada. But thank you for that. That felt, it makes me feel so freaking cool and appreciated and recognized. <laughs> um, Jags fan? Yeah, I'm from Jacksonville, so that's it. it, it which, that's also confusing too. I'm technically from Minnesota and Wisconsin and Jacksonville and Pennsylvania. Not, not, not Pennsylvania, I'll scratch that off. But the other three, I think I'm qualified to say I'm from there. I seriously love your videos, man. Oh, man. all right. Now, where did that come from? The, okay, all right. Okay, don't show that again. Boom. Yeah, this thing's this thing's garbage. This recent events tab is garbage. I'm gonna go through here. L. Gabe, I seriously love your videos, man. I never I donated $5. I've never given money on streams, but I love your content, man. Keep it up, so happy for you. Thank you so much. Yeah, and that's super appreciated. Oh, I hate this. this don't show me this or whatever. YouTube, <laughs> YouTube Live can show you your analytics. It makes a live graph of like your stream numbers going up. And I can totally imagine streaming. And after a few hours, that or after a couple hours, after a couple minutes maybe, just that's starting to tank lower and lower down. <laughs> that would uh, be so depressing. Okay, let me do that. I'm just gonna go there. Stream health, what's its blood pressure? Okay, I'm gonna do one little, I haven't done this in a while. I, I guess I might be out of focus. Boom. Is that, oh yeah, it's pretty good. There we go. I don't think it was out of focus, but just in case. And then righteous indignation with the 12, with the 1150, which in, uh, American, I believe you just add $32 to that. Best of luck with YouTube full time. Your content is very enjoyable. Looking forward to seeing more of it in the future. Thank you so much. Blurry Jack. Am I still, am I blurry? How do I look on there? Pulling it back up, pulling it back up. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, my producer is pulling it back up. My goon, you're playing Phantom Liberty. I love it. I finished it a week in Fug. It, me, it was awesome. Okay, great. I don't want to know any other things about it. I mean, like, well, you guys can tell me like how you felt about it, but I, I, no spoilers for, has, have been brought to me yet, which is great. Okay, yeah, I think that was great. Um, Chum, nice, Luigi. Uh, what was I going to say? Uh, yeah, I haven't had anything spoiled for Phantom Liberty yet. I want to show you guys something very interesting. So I'm going to I'm going to flip to the game real quick and then we're going to talk about something. Then we're going to actually play the game. All right. So here's the game, right? Here's me walking around in it. I'm level 38. Got 50 street cred, not a big deal. Uh how's it still up? Yep. Just tell me how it looks. Just tell me how it looks. I want to make sure this is like crystal. Oh, uh, it's beautiful. Looks beautiful? Okay, great, great, great. Cool. Any mods installed? I only, okay, yeah, that's that's the stuff that I kinda wanna talk about for a second. Game looks freaking gorgeous though, right? Looks beautiful, ray tracing is on, and that is what I wanna fucking talk about real quick, okay? Actually, I'll just leave this on in the background. I don't think anything's gonna happen. Although, I feel like I've been like trying to redo my attributes and stuff and 
Every time I do that, I, like a, an assassin pops out. Okay, well, let's keep it right here and just, just just chat for a second. How's the volume too? Is this like, can you guys hear them honking and stuff? Is that, is that good? That ray tracing OMG. Okay. I'll give you a good view too. Let's see. Let's see if we can, wait, let's see if we can go get like a really sick view. Let's see here. We'll use this guy. Actually, no, I want a shinier car. Just to, just to help. That's my Cthulhu, not a big deal. And then this, right over here, is my Avenger. That's some ray tracing right there. <laughs> Freaking car looks like it's wrapped in tinfoil. Some Reynolds wrap. Okay, let's get over here. This looks actually fucking insane right now. Like, like I'm not even saying that in a good way. There we go. There's something that looks a little too weird about my car a second ago. All right, let's get to a good no game sound. Is it really not? Is, it, is there music playing? Low game sound. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Game is a touch quiet. Cool. This, all right, let me let me actually cut off the uh, the radio. Dude, why does it look like that? What the hell? <laughs> Maybe it's because I didn't throw on Psycho. Let me let me do Psycho. There's a couple graphics I threw to medium because they're like weird in uh, in the background of things. Actually, it's not even a couple. I only turned down. Oh, you know what? I should though, just because we're streaming, I should. So I think it's ambient, subsurface, and then volumetric shit. I'm gonna turn that down to medium. The rest were good though. Honestly, do I even need to do that though? Ah, whatever. I'm just trying to get to... I mean, this is honestly probably fine. I want to get like a high bridge vantage point or something of the city. We'll go down here. All right. Sick. All right, you can see the city. You can see puddle reflections a little bit. And uh, yeah, looks Looks pretty gorgeous. This is honestly isn't a really great place either to do this, but I want to talk about this for just for a second. Okay. What's the GPU? I got a 4070 Ti. Let's go here. All right. So I, I ran into something today. I was prepping for the um, I was prepping for the, the stream and figuring out like a place because I so here's the deal. <laughs> <laughs> I have beaten all of Cyberpunk. Uh, ooh, see, I got to start recording. There we go. Good. So I have beaten all of uh, Cyberpunk 2077. I beat it yesterday, last night, and I also got to get to my freaking donos. It's weird. So, okay. All right. Let me get to those real quick, too, before I, let me. I, I'm telling you guys, it's going to be rusty for a second. Tris W donated five dollars to the chat. Um, good luck with ditching the W two life. I truly love your content and your video essay structure is awesome. The right amount of nostalgia versus criticism. Thank you so much. I know the nostalgia thing's a little tricky. Sometimes I don't like to go like too far into it, but I like to touch it a little bit. I like to say hello, you know, shake its hand, keep it moving. Um, Adam Wojuk donated five dollars through the super chat. Sorry if I said your last name wrong. Loved your videos. Congrats on going full time, boy. Started playing Cyberpunk recently too, and it's dope. I agree. And then Universe donated five dollars to the super chat. Thank you guys for donating so much. This is crazy. The um, Fan of Liberty hit me different. I hope you are prepared. Great. By the way, how long do you guys think um, uh, the Fan of Liberty the storyline is? Because I just beat Cyberpunk, and I really like like I do with most games that I really like want to. Especially one that I want to invest like a good, like a dense video with. With Cyberpunk, I just really wanted to, to um, take it 
take my time with it and like you know not like rush it as much as i can i definitely got the dash ability unlocked but i didn't rush the the story uh about 20 hours 20 or 30 okay okay good 30 for max cool um because i think okay so i beat cyberpunk now that we're all caught up thank you again for the donations i beat cyberpunk last night uh i got the uh rogue and johnny uh ending i was like homies with johnny by the end of it except i hated how like there was some parts of dialogue uh, uh, and not not a hate it, I, it, it was a little weird how many times like i would me and johnny are getting buddy buddy and i say something that's like the option to be what i thought was like nice to him and then it's like yeah you're still a fucking dick bag but whatever and i'm like well i didn't mean to call him a dick bag the um and then there's there's things that are uh, uh, d just like kind of random things where like I can't tell if Johnny actually likes me or if he's lying to me, um, and like it basically like not to spoil anything, but like he actually can have a change of heart. You know, he's not only a villain, I guess. Um, but so at the end, I kind of was caring about Johnny, so I was giving them the keys over to my my body. That sounds weird, but that's what it is said as. I let him dealt to my body. Uh, I let, I gave him the keys to my body, and when he need, when he wanted to do something, and then he gave the keys right back after, like he promised. And so I started to trust him. I'm like, okay, you can actually do this, and and that's dope. He, um, I'm sorry, I'm I'm trying to find my point that I was getting at. Yeah. So the ending that I got was when uh, with Johnny and Rogue like attacking Arasaka or whatever uh and then I chose to oh sorry I realize I'm like I'm kind of spoiling stuff fuck should I do that on a stream do should I am, am, do you guys care if I like say like I don't mm, 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 mm. what I just said isn't really a spoiler it's like obviously you're after Ars Arasaka all the time is with Johnny I think I'm safe so far but um do it, do it, do it. Uh, I won't. I won't spoil it. I won't spoil it. I won't say anybody who dies or anything like that. I won't spoil it like that. But I will talk about generalities, like, and you won't know what I'm fucking talking about, which is like the ending that I got, like going to a uh, uh, going into a spaceship. Let me say that. <laughs> the um, pretty wild. The uh. I did not expect that to happen. Hey, give me one second. The, yeah, that was like a really weird. Is that loud? Or is it just me? What? Is that loud? Huh? Okay. It's weird. I can like hear like everything in my headset and my voice and my surroundings of like Spider Man, like being able to hear all my surroundings while I talk into a microphone. Anyway. Yeah, I uh, I did not uh, expect that. Also, like I woke up in like a bougie house. Like, how, what can I? How can I say this, dude? I even there. I even had to reload when I was doing the ending, and I was like walking to the. I just tried to like. I'm trying to talk about this, but I don't know how many people don't like me spoiling it. I don't know how many. I'm gonna talk about it. I apologize. So, I chose to let Johnny go into the afterlife, basically. But I was playing as Johnny because I had I gave him my keys to my body. And he drove he rode me. He rode me. And he goes into heaven. Space cyber heaven. And then I leave and I and I'm still dying, I think. But when I was doing that, when I was Johnny going to the heaven, I had to reload once because like I said as Johnny, I told V, I was like, hey, man, I'm not going to fuck you over. I'm going to go into cyber heaven. And then he's like, you are lying sack of shit, Johnny. And I was like, why was that the reaction? It was so weird. Anyway, um, yeah, I went into heaven and then I woke up uh, as V in like a bougie ass house um, with Pan Am there and naked, Brad, um, bandana on her head, though, in the shower. Thought that was kind of weird. But anyway. We, I leave 
And then there was a bug that I ran into where uh, basically a, uh, not a spaceship, but a one of those Delamine space or, um, aircrafts comes and picks me up. It's all fancy and bougie. I get inside of it. And every time I got inside of it, this is a known bug right now. Every time you get inside this ship, unless you, the fix to this is you spam the map button. If you don't do that, you die. So I literally was like, is this me dying? Like it, it kept flatlining. I had to reload like five times because I would step onto this Delamine aircraft and then die immediately. And I'm like, I guess my time, my ticker is like dying right here. Very strange. That happened to you too? Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's so weird. Anyway, um, so that happens. And then I basically go do this um, last operation. I say goodbye to Pan Am. It's tearful. Gave her a hug. Um, it's not really tearful. She's actually like very mad at me the whole time. And I, uh, you know, come on. Let's get some empathy going. Anyway, I go do this last job. I meet this guy at the afterlife. He's basically a high-end Illuminati. I don't know if he's part of the, the rest of the game, but his name is Mr. Blue Eyes. Reminds you of anybody? Um, and he's uh, he's like, like a, just a super bougie-looking dude with blue glowing eyes. And um, it was very cool to talk to him. And like the little like lore around him, like I read a message or something in like a computer that was saying um, that it was like, it's so funny that I, my member thing is still wrong. <laughs> Welcome to the arcade. Um, but this mission that he's talking about that I'm doing for him is very vague. And I'm like, okay. And then I end up, uh, next thing you know, on a spaceship. Uh, and I'm going to, uh, what do you call? Uh, I'm going to go do a heist in the space. Um, I'm going to do a heist in the space. Casino that is like advertising sign. It looks like a giant like space station or whatever and I'm floating towards it And then the game ends and for the Crystal Palace. Thank you. And um, I really thought the I Really thought the game was gonna like let me do the mission and then I said out loud Fortunately, my, my, my I was doing this solo and my mic was muted So I can't even like hear myself say this but I say I'm like if the game ends right here That's okay. And then as soon as I said that it turns black <laughs> the screen went black and then uh yeah, game's over. It was great. I had a lot of fun. I did, my build was main, was weird. And by the way, I'm going to get to these um, chats in a second. I just don't want to lose my train of thought. My build was a sand vision. What's that one? What's the one word? The, uh, my ability was like to be able to slow down time. Uh, katana wielder, samurai, I guess you could say. So it was the sand vision, katana swordsman, uh, throwing dagger, uh, like all reflex stuff. It's switched now because I, I switched it, um, for this, this run. Let's see here. Character. Yeah. So I was like all reflex and all cool. So I was all these guys throwing. And then I was all these, the middle and the right. Um, I was licking the sword. And then this guy, juggler, crazy guy. I was that. So I was jumping around, dashing around, and killing everybody with sword. Did not do like anything with intelligence and guns, which I feel like was the move because everybody says to do that. Um, uh, I looked up some builds of like, what's the most fun with the 2.0? Because I know that there's like easy ways that you can do the wrong thing in cyberpunk at least in the 1.0 version where it's like hey i did all crafting and that's fucking garbage or whatever so yeah looked into that before i started building it didn't really like look, look into it too deeply though because i was like what just what's the dash and the sword stuff um let's see did a gunslinger build hacking everything is the way Sand Devastan, thank you. Yes, Sand Devastan. Sand, sand Vision is what I always saw, and I still see that. <laughs> um, Berserk and Body is 20. Let's do this. Chocolate Milk, no, it's iced coffee. Which I haven't even like taken a sip of yet, so the, um, you guys are about to see a real cracked out version of Jack. 
Um, handgun build was so much fun. What, what, what would handgun even be? Would that be reflex then? Or not reflex, it'd be cool, yeah. This guy. See, my, my, all right, so now I've been messing around with the Netrunner build, which is in intelligence, and it's weird. Um, you just one tap everyone. Man, displayed build. Okay, here's my thing that I've discovered so far. That it, what it feels like. It feels like this shit. By the way, I can turn off the volume, sorry. I just want to make sure these are all the way up too. Okay, cool. This shit, the mono wire, the mantis blades, the gorilla gloves, the um, rocket arm, and every uh, thing talking about building your place, they're like, long game, it's fucking useless, which sucks. And I felt this. As, as a Cantana wielder, you, which is using blades, you also are getting the benefits for your Mantis blades. But the Katana at the end of the day is so much better. It's so much better that it's like, I never went to the Mantis blades unless somebody took away my Katana. Then I use the Mantis blades. Or if I wanted to like look cool doing, you know, stabby stab moves. Um, I know that there's a couple of benefits for, you know, using certain types of cyberware with like the model wire, like, uh, they get so much better in Liberty. I remember the Katana being completely broken. Gorilla Arms, Arm Cannon don't depreciate nearly as bad as the Mantis Plates or Mono Wires. See, the, and, and then there's some people that will make it a defense for the Mono Wire. But in the end, I'm like, okay, here's what's the most broken right now, and I think everybody can agree to this, is the build that I'm doing right now, which I just wanted to try out, and I'm like, I'm not loving it so far. Let me say that. I'm not lo- Oops, sorry. I just started doing the thing, which is, uh, what is this? Net running or, or scanning, whatever. And basically it's to where, let me see if I can just go do this on some people. It's where you just hack everybody at once and like, no joke, you like one shot kill everybody. It's pretty wild. Also like, this isn't like super loud for you guys. Let me know if it is super loud. That, like that's so loud in my headset, but I'm actually okay with it so far. Okay, this is great, great, great. We can try it right here. All right, we'll even do a little, uh, can't save in the middle of the air, okay. Now I can save, great. This is, this is what net running, <laughs> I'm like, coffee's kicking in. The, um, this is what net running is. Are there people in there? <laughs> okay, now that looks cool, not gonna lie, but it's usually not <laughs> It's usually not that cool looking Carry this casual. I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know, I know. Dude, I never had to fucking parry after using the katana. I just like cut through everyone. What is it? Like parrying those big guys? What did I do for that? I think I just would use the sand vision and then turn around, like turn on their backs and then cut them down that way. Nut running. Yep. Yep. Honestly, that's the first time I've done a self destruct vehicle. Can you not loot people when they're dead in a car? I feel like I've run into this issue before. You love that thumbnail? Thank you, Matthew. Okay. Avoid Sand Vision Militech Opo Opoji if you're wanting to reflect bullets. It slows times by 80%. Here's, here's what I'm getting, uh, getting at. Net running seems really broken, and to me, just to me, I, I understand like if people really love like mowing through people, the most fun way to play the game, a lot of the times isn't the most like, I'm cutting through everybody. Like I actually still want some like challenge. Dude, I fought Adam Smasher. That was like the easiest fight of my life. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? What, what did I want to say though? Um, okay, also, well, hang on. 
There is there's something else I want to get at, but what, what did I need to do? Shit, I need to do something. Yeah, it's 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 got me scattered. I'm totally spaghetti brained right now. Oh, I forgot to. I never posted my. Uh, Sorry. Yeah, my Instagram. Lol. They didn't fix Smasher. It was a cool ass fight, but I just fucking railed him. Sandy is kind of nervous since he can't use any hacks. I know, and then you're like cutting off half the game, which I didn't know how I felt about that. Okay. I want to hear how loud that is. I want to hear how loud that is. Okay, I can't. No, 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 no. Don't tell me I. Okay, gosh, I thought I got the cost for a second. I know I was talking about, um, so why, why does my car look like that for a second? Also, I did do the path tracing thing. Let's, let's talk, let's talk optimization real quick. Let's talk optimization, guys. I wish Adam Smasher was more like Smasher from Edge Runner, aka more accurate. I did love how much, um, Adam Smasher is just like an abrasive, just meat machine mess of a guy or whatever like his i just love that he's just like you look like a piece of fuckable meat or whatever like just his crazy darkness i have not seen edge runners yet i need to see that before i make a video about cyberpunk um and then i'm sure i'm gonna like want to play even more cyberpunk but anyway okay so number one let's talk about let's talk about optimization what gosh i'm like right under a announcer box let's drive around a little bit more this car is like handling is so it's like driving a damn boat jeez <laughs> we got it we got it you know what I just realized it is? It's the fucking settings I turned down. I think it's the subsurface scattering stuff. Yeah, we'll just keep all that shit on high. Maybe it's not, I don't know. It's got this weird... I don't know what that is. It's just this car. Let's let's hop in the uh, let's hop in the original. Also, let me get to your guys' uh, donations here in a second. Let's do this guy. All right. Let's ride. Let's ride out of town real quick. Or somewhere a little quieter. Then we got to talk about uh got to talk about ray tracing and shit. Oopsies. All right, let's go over here. Woo! Is that Mr. Blue Eyes? <laughs> this is what I do love about the cyberpunk world. There's like constantly crime scenes like poking up all over the place. Where's that radio? I think I had that toxic grenade accidentally equipped at some point. Oh, relax. I'm just blowing up stuff so it doesn't make noise. I'm sorry. Okay. Alright. 
the oh that's my car <laughs> the um the kid soon donated five dollars through am i really getting seen right now they just smashed my motorcycle they do not care i don't know if i can lose the cops this way i'm gonna try to Jeez Louise! Let me get away from these guys real quick, and then we'll chat. Alright? Gosh, of course they're like all over the place right now. Let's go this way. No! <laughs> Come on, baby. Oh, dang it. Thought that was going to be cool. I wanted to do a Jason Bourne move. Come on. Come on. Come on, old blue. What? Oh, I'm going into a mission. No. No, just don't get seen. There we go. Just break the legs real quick. There we go. Oh, I forgot that I have blood pump now. I don't even like know what that really does yet. Okay. This is a cool little place. I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of bad guys here too that we can kill. Sweet. Should we kill some real quick? Alright, let's do it real quick. You're probably gonna die anyway. Yep, shit. Okay. Let's talk. I'm gonna play so rusty in front of you guys because I don't know how to net runner yet. I'm not. I, I know how to katana and throwing knives. Oh, I um, XP. Yep, I already got that going. That's in the old cyberware. He's talking about using. Um, uh, what do you call it? Where's my cyberware? The blood pump with the bio monitor, with there, uh, the, the basically this thing will activate whenever I get under a certain uh, my health item will hit me once I get low enough health automatically and this one boosts the shit out of my health and gives me more like it overheals me and with this intelligence thing with my brain uh, what does this do uh, oh yeah yeah I have a thing called overclock that makes it so like I can like a attack a bunch of guys that uses more of like basically what my mana is if i don't have the mana available it uses health um my ram and uh i can use that a ton and then it'll damage me a bunch and then it will automatically heal me those those items in the cyberware stuff so i can keep on using uh using quick hacks or whatever which is really cool i just don't i'm not like good with the flow yet but i know what they do because i've been reading a lot okay the Kitsune donated five dollars to the super chat. Hey Jack, what do you what would you rate the main story from Cyberpunk 2077? It's good. It's funny. I don't even really know what the main story is. Um, not saying I don't know what it is. It's I it it's I feel like all the side tales are like very well intertwined, and I think the whole game is experienced. The story is uh, solid. I think it's solid. Um, I think it's solid. 
I don't really have any, I'm not saying it's a masterpiece by any means, but it's good and the characters feel great. And like, especially coming off of Starfield, the animations in this game are so fucking good. It's, they're so good. Um, and like certain lighting, people look like borderline, like photo real. Like it's, it's awesome. Um, so like the connections that I had with the characters were like so much better than they are in a lot of games. Even I will even say this, they were even better than what I've been experiencing in Baldur's Gate 3 so far, but that's also because I'm playing co-op with a friend and like we're like making fun of the characters. So I'm not really having that same single player experience as like me alone in my room being like like texting Pan Am like, hey honey, I miss you today or whatever. So it's it's a little less personal in that regard. Um but yeah, so I'm very excited to play Phantom Liberty. I think it's going to deliver on that front as well. And Susie Hunter, my first YouTube friend, is in the in the game. In the game, which is fucking crazy. Um, I can't wait to see her in game. It's going to be wild. Um, did I say Susie Hunter? I meant Sphere Hunter. Anyway. the um, Let's see. Good to see you streaming on YouTube. Oh, okay, gosh. Let me get to these donos. All right. Defiant Zombie donated $10 through Super Chat. Um that was my that wasn't my favorite ending. Yep. Um I liked my ending. I, I didn't I didn't hate it though, which is great. Um Console Peasant donated five dollars to the super chat. Good to see you streaming on YouTube again and playing Cyberpunk no less. Would love to see you finish this on stream. Much love. Agreed. Um Oh, you know what? Let me do this. There we go. So I can get a little bit of a little bit of tunes in the background just to not make it sound like I'm aimlessly reading which I am uh Austin Marks donated five dollars to the super chat what's your favorite uh what's up my favorite full-time creator oh come on thank you mega awesome man has become a member thank you so much Paul Barry Barryski Paul Barryski donated ten dollars to super chat congratulations on going full-time loved your Starfield review by the way thanks so much um Universe dinner. Okay, and then we're then we're caught up. Okay, great, good stuff, good stuff. Defiant zombie. Oh, oh, it wasn't the worst ending. By just down, donated another five dollars. Thank you. <laughs> oh, it wasn't the worst ending by any stretch. Looking forward to seeing your full uh, review. Thank you. Um, okay, so there is something. Let me go back to this. Let's talk uh, graphics. I don't think I, I've been I've been wondering how to phrase this so I'm probably gonna do a bad job it's so funny like on my Starfield video my like the the real review of it or whatever um or what did I call it the good and the bad of Starfield um the mostly bad uh that Starfield video um I feel like I I hit a lot of uh it was much more bullet pointier than it was full script. And I feel like with Cyberpunk, it's like, there's so many things where I'm like, gosh, I'm gonna have to like full script this out. Like, cause it's very technical in what I'm trying to explain. Um, it was a little loud in my headphones, sorry. Okay. So by the way, look at this shitty LOD right there. This this is the kind of stuff that I'm talking about. Do you see this, this blurry ass tree in the middle here? The, um, so, the fuck i'm losing it i'm losing it again hang on hang on Cyberpunk. okay yes the thing that i was trying to say is i don't know if like cyberpunk bit off more than it could chew it clearly did with its release and all that kind of stuff but it's like even still the optimization is like the game is just it, it is too much for um what most gpus and most computers can like handle today and i'm wondering how the consoles are even skating by because yes you might i'm not sure if you guys can see my frames per second but like right now i'm running 85 frames per second i'm on ultra ray tracing psycho mode everything's on high um but the way i'm getting there is through dlss frame generation Okay, now I'm, I'm gonna like, I'm not gonna look at the chat for a second because I gotta explain this like, like without me stuttering through it and, and being a completely unconnected mess. Okay, so I realized something today that 
like bummed the shit out of me and then like kind of didn't at the same time. So basically DLSS, if you don't know, is like an anti-aliasing, I might be saying this wrong, but like it's like an anti-aliasing thing for NVIDIA graphics cards. I think it also works on AMD now, whatever. They both have like a version of this. It's like super sampling, ah, whatever. I might be saying some of this wrong. It makes things look better and run way smoother if it's activated in most games. It's just a way to like, I don't know, it's AI, Stuff, great, maybe, I don't even know, fucking, I don't know. But I gotta do my research. But DLSS doesn't do frame generation on its own. That's like a separate feature that you can activate in Cyberpunk. So DLSS, I turn on and I'm like, uh, I turned on and no joke, if I turned my frame, so this is before frame generation. I played this entire game without frame generation on. Uh, which uh, DLSS frame, frame generation, it's AI upscaling, okay. Um, damn it, I'm reading your guys' comments again. All right, <laughs> get through this. The, um, so uh, I didn't have ray, uh, I beat the entire game, like, you know, last night I beat it, I finished it. And what I'm getting at is, I didn't know that there was the frame generation option until today. And then I turned it on today and then I started getting like 120 frames per second. And even if I put on ray tracing and everything, all this shit just like I could now use. And it looks amazing. The game looks amazing without ray tracing though too. It really does. Like, so that's why I'm not like super bummed. Like my whole game still looks awesome. But like stuff like this where you see this light reflecting directly off this water puddle, like um, there's certain things that like don't come through without ray tracing on. Not even that, by the way. It's also like just ray tracing. There's multiple things that you can turn on with um, ray tracing. So like right now I have reflections on, the sun shadows, local shadows, psycho. And then I've even been able to pump out 60 frames, 70 frames with the path tracing technology brought on. If I don't have frame generation on, this shit runs at like 30 frames maximum like it's crazy with frame generation i get like 75. now the whole game i played through the whole main story i was on basically high graphics with a few medium graphics uh graphics turned to medium and i was in high uh density locations like like cities and stuff i would get like no joke it would low it would go as low as like 32 frames per second but for the majority, it was like laying around like 50 to 65. And then if I was in like, you know, more tight locations, easily over 100, that's fine. Um, but a lot of the game, you're traveling through like 40 frames per second stuff. So it's like, well, then how did I get up to 120 frames or whatever? And how is everybody else at 120 frames? The, th the reason why I did this was like, okay, if I'm gonna stream this game, let me look up even more optimizing stuff. Cause I'd already looked up optimizing stuff and then I was like, this is good enough. Let me just start playing the game. I looked up optimizing stuff for, um, I looked up optimizing, today I looked up optimizing the game for specifically a 4070 Ti. And that's where I looked at, like I found a comment in a Reddit that was like, it's using DLSS quality on, on 80 or whatever, but it's number one is make sure frame generation is turned on. A lot of computers don't have this feature turned on because it's like, you have to adjust a window setting first and you do. Because by the way, it's so funny. Like I, I looked up when I looked up the 4070 Ti thing on Reddit, I was like optimization for this game. So many people were like, I get this like 120 frames all the time, easily over 100. I'm like, is everybody just fucking lying? Like what the hell? I have a 4070 Ti and my frames suck. The um, like they're not terrible, but they're like not great. Then I found out about the DLS frame generation. I turned that on, and what that does is basically use AI to fill in the gaps of your frames that like. Like, um, it makes it a way smoother experience. Like, have you ever seen like TikToks or, or Instagram reels that like are viral of a movie that you love, but it looks like a soap opera? It's because they're using like AI upscaling to like fill in the frames and make it a weird smooth experience, which honestly ruins whatever the uh, director was like going for, but maybe that's just me. Anyway, so 
I immediately was stoked to be able to run ray tracing at full frames, 120 frames per second, everything on high, it looks amazing. That's awesome. But, but the one thing about frame generation is that it's filling in the gaps of your live gameplay and that in, if you're getting low frames, it's generating a lot of frames per second additional. It causes like a slight delay in your mouse which I thought was weird. Um, so it's like you're getting amazing looking experience and amazing, uh, s amazingly smooth experience, but every now and then when, you, when you're back in those dense situations, you'll notice a slight like sluggishness in your mouse. It's very, very slight, so it's totally worth it. Um, but it is funny. It's just like, it does get a little, uh, little weird here and there. Oh, I just got noticed. So I'm gonna go kill this person the uh, the way I do it now, which is using my burnout move. Boom. I'm gonna run this way. Do a burnout on that guy. Burnout on this guy. Burnout on that guy. And then now everybody should die. And I don't have to play the game. <laughs> That's why I don't really love this whole override thing. Um, but you know, we'll see. And now I just use the health booster, which I haven't gotten used to that, like, giant flashbang that goes off. Yeah, it's, it's input latency, yeah. Frame generation is interpolated fake frames, therefore it adds input delay. AMD actually just added a similar feature called AMD fluid motion frames that can be used at, uh, at the driver level on any game. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, they're just visual frames, not com computational, so input is still being processed at 30 frames per second or whatever the underlying frame rate is. Yeah, exactly. It feels fake. It feels fake. So I was like, I wasn't too bummed. Uh, like, you know what it feels like? It feels like, you, you know those cars, like, oh, I forgot what they're called. I think they're called kit cars, where you see a Lamborghini, but it's really like a Mazda Miata underneath it. Like, it's got the Mazda Miata, uh, it's like engine and everything like that, but it's got the shell of a Lamborghini. That's what I feel like I'm doing with frame generation. It's like, this looks awesome, this feels awesome, it's so cool that I can like experience this, but there's this like weird delay where I'm like, is this chugging right now? Like it feels like it's chugging, and it is chugging. Doesn't have it, doesn't have the latency boost. Uh, yes, and it's locked enabled, I believe, when you do frame generation. Uh, so yeah, it's I can't even mess with this anymore. Reduces system latency and improves game responsiveness. It's really not bad, but I just I just noticed it and I was like, oh, that's kind of, you know, a little bit of a bummer. But it's much better than than what I what it was, um, which is like, I prefer this, one hundred percent over how I played the entire game, which does get me bummed out. I'm like, fuck, I could have had awesome looking footage that whole time and and it'd be fine. But yeah, all right. I just, I wanted to talk about that. I knew that was going to be a bitch to get through, so we got through it. <laughs> um, but yeah. And then uh, here's my wacky guy. You guys want to see my outfits? <laughs> this is my full-blown... Hang on, hang on. Let me, let me get over here. This, this is my full-blown Cybernet, uh, or Cyber Runner outfit. I haven't used it once yet because, I don't know, it doesn't look that great in my opinion. This is my suit. This is my date night outfit. Not gonna lie, um, I had to whip it out a quite a few times with a few different ladies, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, I even tried to woo Judy with it um, after I heard that she's only into femmes, so I cut my penis off, and she still wasn't attracted to me. So I put it right back on. Got out the old Allen wrench, tightened that junk right back on. All right, this is probably my favorite outfit, to be honest. Um, it's kind of a junkier version, you know, I just think it's kind of cool. You know, this is what I use to slice people up. And my throwing knife and my katana. It's also like a color palette you don't see very often. It's not just your classic white, red, and black. It's more of a grungier army type. You know, some, something I just cobbled together. Like a Leonardo cobbled together David. Anyway. Um, motorcycle outfit, of course, helmet for safety, samurai jacket, very cool. Number five, I don't even know what this is. Oh, this is the one that I had on. Okay, cool. And then number six, the classic. Boom. V's 
jacket, or it's actually, I think it's, I think it's technically Johnny Boys. Um, and I got the dog tags, got the DTs, got the, uh, got the pants to match it, leather shoes. I mean, can't go wrong with the brown leather shoes. And then a little eye tracker thing that, um, has no effect, but looks visually kind of cool. Yeah. And that's, uh, that's it. But sometimes I feel like everybody's going to be using this jacket, so I don't want to use that jacket, so I use this, but I also feel like everybody's going to go black and red because it's like the coolest look, so I don't want to use that, so I sometimes go back to three where I'm like, nobody's going to be using this color palette. And I look crazy, and my hair got spikes. Um, I had long hair the whole game, but now I'm I'm a different guy. See, it's funny. Me, t me moving up right there felt so weird because I know the game was coming back into the game, and it's, it's frames probably dropped for a second and then got back up. And now it feels fine, but, you know. All right. Do I have the Witcher jacket? Hey, hey everybody, welcome in. Very poorly optimized. The PL areas, public living areas are very poorly optimized. You know what's crazy? It's like, I feel like the place I get the lowest frames, bold move on Cyberpunk's part, is leaving my apartment. Like every time I'm in that apartment place, it like easily the lowest frames. It's when I'm like walking up to it and inside of it. And God damn it, this ad is everywhere. This ad is everywhere. It's everywhere. It's, I'm not kidding. I have a joke about it in my fucking, oh, it's a cool ass graffiti though. What are you guys? Who are you guys? Are these bad guys? Where are these guys? Hang on. Night City. It's a Valentino. I'm gonna consider you a bad guy. So I can do that. Boom. Overheat. What? I don't have enough? Oh, yes, I do. Boom. Overheat. And bam. Overheat. Hit with another synapse and an overheat. You guys are all dead. See ya. Pretty cool. I don't like when I shoot people on the ground, they stand back up. What the hell? Penis one or two. Um, let's keep it real, guys. I went with the big penis. I was, uh, I just, just wanted to live the dream. <laughs> You're a literal cyber vampire. Funny Netrunner build. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know how I feel about it. I don't know how I feel about the Netrunner build. It's, it's just, uh... God damn you. Hey, relax. I didn't, it wasn't at anybody. Calm down. Oh, dang it. I thought that did damage. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. Oops. Okay, can I call my car? Yes, I can. My 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 uh my horse. Woo. And there's part of me that wants to go like uh I've I've seen this viral build of uh some guy doing a doom build. Basically like shotguns and melee weapons the whole time. Uh, not melee weapons, like like grill arms. And uh, I thought about doing that. Look at how many freaking legendaries are up in here. Hide in the trash, be with the trash, Jack. Yo, was that a straight up hammer? Is it, is it gonna be a big one? Oh, it is, okay, never mind. Thought it was literally gonna be like a hammer. Okay, good, we got the cops off. Throwing knives are addicting. And now, you know, and I don't really love the smart weapons. I don't know, I don't know. All I know is we should definitely start playing the game. I think we've had enough time dicking around, talking about stuff, catching up. 
Thank you to everybody congratulating me on uh, quitting my job, though. It's it's awesome. I just returned my work laptop today, and that's like the last little like that was the last piece of like they still got the claws in me, so I gave that away, um, and I'm free. <laughs> it is, yeah. It's just been weird. It's been it's been a weird. We I I kind of like let myself adjust this week. Like I did like. I just wanted to do a lot of exercising and just s sleep, like uh, getting my sleep schedule right. Cause I want those to be most, <laughs> it's so funny. Like I wanna, I, I wanna work out not to get like, like super ripped. That'll obviously happen on its own. The, um, I, I actually just wanna like feel better and have my brain be like working as fast as it can. And tonight I've only had 79,000 brain farts. <laughs> the, um, so it's working. No, actually, I actually haven't been to the gym like the past three days. I gotta get back on it. Tomorrow, no skipping. Um, I had to work today. I had to play some video games. I did actually, I, I really wanted to get things properly set up for this. And of course, when I started the stream, first two minutes, no volume, all good. Still getting over it. Um, but yeah, that's like what this first week of no job has been. I got the video out, uh, telling you guys that I'm, I quit my job, it's been Unbelievable the support that everybody's like giving me there. It's very 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 cool um, But yeah, it's it's just it's been like a it's been like a weird week It's almost like I've just kind of like let myself pause for a second reset recalibrate then uh, get back into it Transitions are often a bit surreal things will feel normal again soon. Yeah, I mean the scariest thing is just like not seeing my, you know, check from my company coming every two weeks or whatever, like, and that's, you know, that isn't, hasn't even happened yet. Um, but I imagine that will feel very weird and feel, feel very on my own when that's not like securely coming in, you know? Are you gonna follow the trend of making a podcast law? Of course, no. Um, I, I don't, I don't, I don't think that's any, anywhere in the near future. I would want to do it with somebody who, I think the only reason why I would do a podcast is like, I if I can talk to somebody that I can bounce off really well, um, not saying it's this person, but like somebody that's like, I can bounce off well, that's like a like a naked jakey kind of person where we can like talk about things endlessly. Uh, I'm not saying I could have that with naked jakey. Like I'm saying somebody like that, like another YouTuber that does that. I think that'd be very fun to, to do. Other than that, I don't really think that there's a podcast in, in the future. The only thing I want to do is just make like the most banging freaking, I thought I almost got smashed by that car, is make the most banging YouTube videos. And I want to I want to start off with a bang with the cyberpunk video. I'm afraid that it's passing me by a little bit. I guess it's still pretty topical. People are still making Starfield videos, which is great. Um, just I feel like I'm like missing the, the cyberpunk stuff, like just a little bit. It's just, it's just so hard. Like making these videos is like, it takes so much time and like, you know, I kind of jokingly say like I was like working playing this video game, but like there's part of me that I'm like, okay, I need to play this game so I beat it so I can make the video. Like and and it and if I don't have enough knowledge, I can't write because like, the knowledge isn't there. Unless I just want to take other people's opinions, which I don't. I want to make it like the most authentic video I can, uh, and then fill in the gaps where like you know my you know experience didn't take me. Like I gotta look up the other endings or like I like I look up. You know different builds and stuff like even my footage the reason why i want to do a net runner or something else is because so much of my footage is just me with a sword like it's like 50 hours of me with a sword and a knife and now like it and barely shooting guns and like i'm gonna talk about the guns at some point in my video so like i gotta get some gun gameplay but it's like far and few between so yeah my mind to miss key love the bang videos thanks um, you have to learn to do a podcast while playing. <laughs> exactly. It's it it like, which is so hard to do. By the way, I don't get how some people, like, um, I think yeah, it's Destiny. Destiny will will talk about the most like, uh, and I think like other people do this too. But he's the example that I'm thinking of. Will play like a super brain intensive game like Factorio and talk about the most like complex economic like social problems in the world at the same time while talking to somebody and debating them or whatever. And I'm like, how do you do that? 
how do you like they must have some sort of like their their corpus callosum trying to sound smart must be divided segmented in such a way that their frontal and back cortexes menge <laughs> i don't know uh, but uh yeah it's very very weird like whereas like i need to stop and hold up traffic in cyberpunk 2077 to talk about which penis type i chose anyway the um what about XQC? XQC just stutters over stuff, so I'm more like XQC than I am anybody else, I guess. Um, I don't really watch streamers, though, so like, I can't, like, uh, I have no other good examples. Try to role play as much as possible. My V never asks questions and always gets the job done. I like that. Most guns that are iconic weapons suck. Interesting. Shotguns go boom, people explode. My thing with the shotguns, though, is like, okay. Have you guys, do you guys think the, not the FOV, it's not the FOV, the way the camera is positioned for shotguns is so weird to me. Like, your arm looks so skinny. It does the thing where it's like, I'm trying to like explain how, like, it does a thing where my arm, hang on, I think I could actually do this. Hang on, if I got some scissors, here we go, we'll use this example. Here's a gun, right? I feel like in most shooters, it's like, your gun is like this, right? I'm actually gonna do this, holy crap. But I feel like with a shotgun in this game, your arm is like, oh, no, fuck, I can't do it, my arm's not double jointed. But it feels like it's like way out here. And then it's like aimed up almost, it's like crazy looking. You know what I'm saying? There was part of me that was so committed to that, that I was like, do I break my elbow for this? I might do it for the video. But yeah, literally when you're shooting a sh when aiming a shotgun, it looks like you're aiming up here. It's very weird. The, um, and I don't, uh, yeah, here, do I have a... It's, these aren't really good examples because this is like a snub nose. This might kind of show it though. The double barrel especially looks very strange though. My shadow looks so goofy. Dude, doesn't it? I totally agree with you. Oh, it's not that goofy though anymore because I've got ray tracing. Sorry. Those shadows, those goofy looking shadows are behind me. No, it does look so weird though, especially if you're walking around with a sword and it's like, ching, ching. It's like only your upper torso moves. There's no animation with like your body. See, this looks kind of fine. This is kind of getting what I'm getting at. This is this a legendary? Damn it. I was gonna say, I was like, I might start using this jump. Looks like it's hip level. Yeah, it's... They don't call it hip fire for nothing. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, yeah, let me see if I can... I think I have one in my trunk, actually. Hold up. Come on. There we go. Let's see... Ah, I don't. Dang it. What is this thing? Oh! <gasps> you know what's crazy? There's a weapon missing out of this thing. And before I started the stream, I did... You guys will know what it is. I did, uh... Sensor... Oh, is this what it is? It is! That's crazy! I did sensor nudity. This is not a what it is. <laughs> That's hilarious. I was like, how is it gonna like censor that stuff? That is wild. Let's see this. So what does it look like? <laughs> it may okay, I was like, is that a glitch? Yeah, it makes a vibrating sound. Funny! Dildo. That's what's what supposed to be. There you go. And that's how it turns off. That's very nice. Okay. <laughs> I thought they were just straight up like not letting me use it, which I was like, how? that's kind of weird. Some people make their builds around that gawk. It looks like a lava lamp. Yeah. <laughs> this is the closest thing to an OnlyFans, yeah. 
So yeah, knives used to be my jam as well. Get out of here. Dang, dude, it's right there. We'll start. Oh, mods. Let's talk mods. Uh, it's, it'll be a short conversation though. I only have one installed. It's about like HD, text, HD textures that are in the game. Um, I did not mean to be going towards Docktown this whole time. I don't want it to like accidentally load in anything that I'm like missing. Um, I'm wondering. Hmm. No, I think we should play with guns this playthrough. I think that's the move. Really enjoyed the Liberty DLC. Okay, good. That's what I'm hearing from everybody. It seems like everybody likes the, um, the DLC. Okay. Um, hold on. We gotta make a, uh, we gotta, we gotta do a couple things. Let's go run into town real fast. Let's go right here. Let's actually start playing the game. Let's let's start. Uh, let's get into it. I think we covered all all the bases. Let me know if you guys have any other cues about anything I've talked about or feel like I missed. But I think we're good. I'm literally just gonna jump my way to this place. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> good. Jump across here. Break my other leg. I just want to make a quick Phantom Liberty outfit. Just one. Okay, I really need to see this. What? All right. Got a bandana. Very cool. Very cool. Are these white shoes or are they the ones with the graffiti on the sides? I don't like, I just want white shoes. There's no white shoes. Dude, I swear. This is something I want to critique as well. Oh, I got to write this down. Genius. This is, this is gold right here. The amount of fucking uh, terrible clothes there are in this game is unbelievable. There, there is, there is, maybe I already wrote this. 75, did I write 75 anywhere? Oh, oh, I did. Where? Yeah, there are no, there are so many clothes, but an overwhelming, overwhelmingly, um, overwhelming amount of terrible clothes. One out of every seventy-five items looks aight. And they also talk about if Keanu Reeves did a good job, which I think he did all right. There is a lot of times where it sounds like he's just standing in a room with a microphone. But, yeah, I probably couldn't do any better. Love the freaking radio right now. Oh, I don't need to sell anything, do I? Oh, I guess I could sell this crap. Ooh, nice knife though. And a nice hammer. That's fine, we're gonna need him. See what you guys said. Whoa, 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 I saw something about ending cab bug. Get out of here. CM winner, what's up, buddy? The writing from Johnny's dialogue is really strong, which helps. Is it? Is it really strong? <laughs> I 
I literally, it's so funny. I, there's a few things that I've like repeated Johnny's lines out loud as soon as they say them in the recordings that I've done. I recorded the whole, my whole main story gameplay. And it's like, there was a thing where he's like, he's, he, said, he said something today that was like, those Valentinos aren't gonna be able, uh, what are they? Fuck, what was it? Yeah, yeah, he said like, the Valentinos aren't really some people that you mess with. They're the kind of people that you don't mess with. And I was like, that took, I swear the whole dialogue took nine seconds to say, and it was like the most unclever way of saying, those are bad guys. <laughs> He's got some real weak one-liners with emotional lines towards the end game. Yeah, and, and I feel like there's like a bunch of reasons like, or there's a bunch of things that he says that are like intentionally, I'm a fucking douchebag corny. Um, Listen here, sweet cheeks or whatever, you know. But it, especially during like the middle to end, like he becomes like a really dynamic character, which I liked. I couldn't tell what his intentions were, if he was going to screw me over, even though I couldn't tell if like I was falling into a plot that he was scheming, which would have been kind of cool if like he was in a lot of ways. And maybe there's a path that he kind of does that more, but I felt like in the end he was like, oh, maybe I shouldn't have killed 12,000 people when I bombed that city. Um, I guess I was kind of a drugged up rocker asshole. And it's like, oh, yeah, You're like, 45 years old, dude. Figure it out. Does Johnny ever say in game, wake the fuck up, samurai? Or is that just in like the trailers? I don't remember him saying that ever. Is it when you get shot in the face? Nope, he doesn't. Exactly. Trailer. Wow. Oh, oh. Robert said, Robert said he does. I believe Robert. <laughs> Oops, sorry. <laughs> Interesting. I was living for the wake up the samurai. Or just like, in the Phantom Liberty, he better call me beautiful. You're all, no, not beautiful, breathtaking. <laughs> Good joke, Jack. Nice. <laughs> I always wanted to wear this American flag shirt somewhere. I just can't find the outfit that that demands it. No nipples V, did you see that? Yep. I'm like Kyle XY. Or Kyle Y. What is it? Alright. <laughs> there was oh, this is like Jack this is like Jason Voorhees clothing. Kinda dig. Guys, I have been watching uh, Friday the 13th movies. Dude, what the hell? Why are these cool ass clothes coming out of nowhere? Th uh, th while I'm streaming. I like spend so much time in the character customs there. <laughs> character customization and uh, nothing is ever cool until I start streaming and now I wanna spend another 45 minutes in here, which I'm not going to. Um, I've been watching the Friday the 13th movies a lot. I've watched eight of them. Uh, I don't know why. Oh, it's October. What am I saying? But I don't know why I had to watch eight of them. <laughs> Part one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then Jason goes to hell is what I watched. Which, by the way, no part in the movie does he go to hell, which was very annoying. I thought it was going to be like him fighting Satan or something like that. Never happens. Jason's not even in the first Friday the 13th, by the way. Nobody told me that. I was waiting for a machete and a hockey mask. Hockey mask doesn't even come until the third movie. It's crazy. I haven't seen Jason X yet, which I've heard is god awful. <laughs> but that's when he goes to the future to kill people in his future summer camp. They get really weird though, like the further they go on, like one one of them has a woman that has telekinetic powers in it and it's like, where did that come from? And it's never mentioned again in the following movies. <laughs> I really do love the first uh, three. I really do love the first three movies though. 
they feel like very iconic, like campy, uh, same pretty much plot line every movie. Hot kids go to summer camp and have sex, and if they do, Jason hates sex, he cuts them up. Um, and then he cuts up everybody else, but they usually go first. Um, yeah, I, I dug it. And it's like, I'm not really into scary movies, but those are so far, they're so old, they're not scary at all anymore. Like, they're just like, they're just corny fun. Um, I realized that when I watched Halloween with my parents like two years ago, which used to terrify me as a kid. Because I would see when he gets, when when uh, Mike Myers gets shot off the two-story building, or two-story, he's on the second floor, he gets shot out of a window. And then he's on the ground, and then they go and check for his body on the ground, and he's gone. That scared the freaking piss out of me as a kid. And now I'm like, oh yeah, that's um, that's not scary at all. <laughs> the, uh, now and like with Jason stuff, even watching people get murdered, I'm like, like it's it's so funny to see somebody get like shot with an arrow in the eye, but they have like two and a half pounds of clay on their face that's like beige colored, and then the arrow, like it just looks like crazy. <laughs> Some of them look really real, like when the wheelchair kid gets the machete in the face, it's brutal. Um, but uh, other than that, it's like, it's just corny fun. I loved it. Ma is a fun, campy horror movie. Interesting. Sleeping Bag was in the 2009 version. They use that again? Dude, the sleeping bag one was brutal on that one girl. <laughs> when he zips up that woman in a sleeping bag and Wait, slams her against tree. a tree. <laughs> Which just kind of came out of nowhere. So There's some times where I'm like, yo, Jason, like, they did not deserve that. <laughs> like, I get killing him, but like, do it gracefully. Have some class. You casually drinking chocolate milk? It's iced coffee, guys. And if it was chocolate milk, I hope you would judge me further than my dairy product of choice. Choice of. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. Let's see. Some of those movies are good. Playing a female when you play. Or... Playing as female when you male in RPG is sus. I'm not a female. I just didn't have a penis for like. 30 minutes when I went on a date with Judy. Okay. Which outfit are we going with? Number one. Okay, yeah. Let's just, let's just overwrite number one. And then Phantom Liberty. We're going to be meeting Idris Elba. Idris. Id Idris. I mean, this literally is Jason besides having purple underwear. Hang on. I got to get covered up. Sorry, guys. Sorry, I didn't mean, to, didn't mean to show you that. We could go with some awesome jorts. Very tempting, very tempting. Let's go, let's go, let's look at the coats real quick. Literally, I just, fucking hell. I hate that right clicking takes you out of the menu. Any Jinko jeans? <laughs> I always forget what Jinko jeans look like. Could get a little bubble jacket going. Oh, I did. I think I did get a new uh, one of these guys, like a black version of it. Or did I just like rebuy? I hate when I accidentally buy something that I already have. This is pretty sick though. I like this bomber. Right? That's very like, I think Idris would be like, yo man, quite like a jacket. Nice drip. It's actually quite nice. I don't, I'm just trying to think of things he would say. <laughs> Nice jacket, mate. Yeah, there we go. Awesome, man. Got it. A little breakage in the... Yeah, 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 yeah. I do want to see my eyes. People say I have very kind eyes. My character, not me. I'm not taking that kind of credit. 
I do like the gold. Look at that. Look at that. That's that's freaking cool. That's that shows them your A1 material. Black jeans, a little plain, but that might be what my carriage is asking for. Gold pants. It's a little flashy, a little flashy for me. Skinny jeans are a little too skinny here, just like how they are in real life when I wear them, but I still do it because I haven't bought new jeans from American Eagle in quite a while. I need to. Thanks for reminding me. Nice, good pants, good butts. Actually, pretty saggy butt. Needs something that the dress is gonna be like. <laughs> This guy's really good with the tanks. Very cool. Oh. This, hang on. Alright, this is definitely gonna be it. That's it right there. Boom. Equipped. Number two outfit. We'll keep the suit. Just in case we go on a date. Number three. We'll keep as well. Number four. Get... Well... Classic V. Classic. Uh, let's get rid of you. There's one more outfit I need. It's very important. You'll see why. <laughs> black hat. Real black hat kind of guy. Is there a pattern on that? I can't even tell. So there is a sturdy... Stir the boot. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Little future cowboy. Little space cowboy. <laughs> what the hell are you looking at, bud? Little Kevin Costner Yellowstone action. I, didn't, I haven't seen the show, but... A little howdy partner. I mean, that might be it. Boom, and then a little snake skin. Nah, nah, that's that's foolish. We'll go traditional. Traditional got some Wrangler jeans, and then what about eyewear? We go something just kind of, you know, do we go Bono where it's like just a tint of blue because he has light eyes and apparently an eye sensitivity? Can relate. I have very, very, uh, I, won't say, I won't say they're very blue, but they are compared to an iceberg quite often. That's not me saying that. It's just what I've heard. Mask, it's a little much. How about just some, some brain dance gear? No, I'm, uh, that's, that's. That's too future. I'm I'm old Earth. <laughs> I'm old Earth. Puts on. Oh wait, aviators. I I want a little bit of future in there. Just one. Just cover one eye with some tech. There we go. All right, cowboy. Little space cowboy. Ooh, and. We gotta, we gotta get better at this whole thing. So if I wanted to attack somebody, I go... Scan. E. Synapse burnout, synapse burnout, synapse burnout. Out. E, I stop the E. Hit all these guys. Then I shoot them with my gun. After I reload... Sorry, buddy. No, don't. Don't try it. You know what? You know what we need to do? We need to do a revolver play. What are we what are we what am I thinking? I mean dude, we're there's a new space sheriff in town. Then get a freaking gun with a 
American Flag magazine. So, the way we're gonna do this, by the way, this is the only other mod I have, is me resetting, having unlimited resetting attributes. Um, so I can do this anytime I want. So, so the way we're gonna do this, and I should have saved before I did that, but whatever. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do, we're gonna choose revolver as, uh, as our main thing. Uh, just for the gun sake, but I think we're still gonna weave in some hacks. Also, we're not level 52, so it's kind of hard to like jump around stuff because like we don't have, we're not able to fill up everything yet. I don't think you can fill up everything even once you're level 50. I think level 50 is the max, but we'll figure this out. Okay, so, knives, silence weapons outside of combat, nope. We do need this, so we're gonna have and maybe we don't need all of these things. What is Dead Eye? Unlike Dead Eye mode, which is active above 85% stamina, one active 20% head headshot damage, weak spot damage. 60 is the max now. Okay, cool. This will allow me to like actually like use. You know, it looks like there's snipers too in this. When you aim at full stamina, no stamina cost for shooting allows more accurate shots. Cool. When focus is active, shooting grenades out of air is easier and the blast is more powerful. That's pretty, that's pretty cowboy. Freaking like, pull, bang, bang. From focus mode for each enemy neutralized while it's active. What is that? Minus 50% stamina cost from focused mode for each in, God, I hate the way they write these things. What? What is costing stamina? Shooting? From focus mode for each enemy neutralized while it was active. Okay. Okay. There's a finisher in here. Throwing uh, throwing people instead though. You need dead eye for sure. Okay, gotcha. Reload speed for your next reload after neutralizing enemy while aiming. Stacks two times. That's sick. So I'll time by 25% for you and your enemies when focus is active. That's pretty slick. You're an enemy with a ranged attack at recess duration. Cool. I don't think we need that grenade one. Imagine we need this when a dead eye active is guaranteed crit hits for headshots and weak points, increases damage and distance enemies, okay. Boom. Anders Johnson with a five dollar donation. Wanted to say love your videos and take and takes, man, and congrats on the move to full-time content uh, creation. I will be here to watch and rewatch. Thank you, Anders. Appreciate the rewatch. As the 470 attacking, uh, tackling Cyberpunk, great. Make sure you have frame regeneration or frame generation turned on um, for the ultimate smooth experience. It's great though. It's Honestly, even without that, I, I still was having fun. I just was like, wow, this is really pushing the limits of like what most CPUs, C most GPUs can do nowadays. Okay. Unlocks dead eye mode, which is active above 80%. Okay. Boom. Also, what are these things doing? Headshot damage, okay. I wanna know, like, is this the weak point thing? No bullet spread too. It's pretty wild. What's the what's the weak point thing? You guys you guys will know what I'm talking about. No, it's not in tech. Is it this? Weak point comes from the relic tree. Is it? Okay. All right, yeah, see, that's what I haven't even messed around with at all yet. Um, when I, when Deadeye is active, guarantees credits for headshots and weak points. Cool. Went above 85% stamina. I'll do no sweat, because I guess stamina is a big thing in focus. This mode automatically activates when you aim by full stamina. Interesting. Weapon swap speed when swipping to, switching to revolver snipers. Uh, I think that's good. 
35% real estate for your next reload after neutralizing an enemy via headshot or weak point. Fantastic. Dude, this is gonna be like bang, 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 bang. I'm gonna be like freaking McCree or Ryan, whatever they call him now. Um, 30 seconds. Slow time by 50% during reload. What? Slows time by 50% during reload. I feel like I'm gonna be like in slow motion a lot. Am I wrong? Uh, Thirty percent stamina after neutralizing an enemy with a range attack via headshot. I, again, I think stamina is gonna be coming off a lot. Oh, it probably when I'm aiming and it's slowing down time, it's probably draining my stamina quickly. That's that's what focus probably does. Let's just go ahead and see it. Why am I not just testing it? Hmm. That's cool. I got a new little thing in the middle. All right, cool. Let's do that. I like this little guy that we're building. Very cowboy, very Western, very freedom oriented in the Phantom Liberty. Very liberty oriented. We'll do quick draw, because we'll probably throw in a sniper in there too. When Deadeye is active, your shots always deal full damage regardless of distance. Sick. Active above 85% stamina. Oh, okay, so that's what the gold thing is. Cool. All right, great, we got that. I don't care about that. Um, I think we should do a little bit, a little bit of hacking, a little bit. Just, just so I can like kind of it's so fucking confusing though, man. It's so confusing. It's not confusing, it's just... Yeah, that's exactly what it is. So this, I can really, you can really throw somebody, huh? Boom, right in the balls. Savage sling, throw enemy instead. Gosh, that's awesome. Maybe we do that too. Get a gun and bash people's heads in. That does look very fun. I haven't been good with uh, this Ed Runner stuff. Is just a little too. It's a little too techy for me. Kind of a moron. All right. <laughs> the um. I think we just need. We definitely need our uh, our dashes. And our mid-air dash, which sucks, because that's a lot of freaking attribute points. But we need it. Mid-air. And then we need our body type. We definitely need this guy. Use that. I don't think we need Fury Road. I dig that. Watch you from Brazil. What's up, Tom? Just gliding across the map, Jack. Hello. What's up, Gabriel? Got to be Arthur Morgan or Arthur Morgan stats. I know. God, of course. <clears throat> if I do intelligence, what am I at now? Three. Cause I don't know how much I don't know how much max RAM we have right now. That's my only concern is like using I'm just trying to figure out like what would be the I mean we, we gotta use some like body points I think. We gotta go shotgun. Just all freaking uh I mean, we got 20 perk points, so we could like even get Savage Sling and shotguns. And we got Dead Eye. I mean, like this, this might be the move. This is the move. What are we doing? This is the move. It's obvious. Uh, but 
Look at my cyber deck. No, I already know, and I already have the wrong cyber deck, even with my net runner. I wanted to go Raven. I want Arasaka. You know how it is. They're the Coca Cola of cyber decks. Instead of cyber deck, you could go Berserker Sandy. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm thinking. If I go, <clears throat> I know. Yeah, that's not, that's what I'm thinking. I might go Berserk. Honestly, I haven't done Berserk yet. I wasn't supposed to get the last point. Dang it. Help items and grenades after neutralizing enemy. Yeah, I doubt we'll have... Ooh, see this? There's some, there's some reflex stuff that we need now. Performing air dashes and double jumps, like in Tailwind, would probably be really clutch. We're probably gonna need this anyway, though. So let's actually keep upgrading that. 100% damage for the next quick melee shot uh, after shooting an enemy with a shotgun. For the next shotgun after quick. Okay, gotcha. Twenty-five percent bullet spread when moving. Okay. Don't stop me now. Mitigation. Fire rate it stands. Stamina decreases. No movement speed penalty with shotguns, light machine guns, and heavy machine guns. Do that. It's gonna be dashing around everywhere. Maybe that's not even worth it though. It's such a small penalty and we're dashing anyway. Yeah, let's not even do it. Barrel into enemies. Quake. Savage Sling. Unlocks Obliterate, the ability to sometimes instantly kill and dismember enemies at low health. But what I like about this tree is that there's, it doesn't seem to be like saying like only with shotguns. <laughs> it literally says in red, only affects shotguns, LMGs, and HMGs. <laughs> well, fuck. Unlocks obliterate ability. Okay, cool. We'll, we'll throw on a shotgun then. 20% reload speed for eight seconds after dismembering an enemy. Increases damage of quick melee attack. I mean, this is like about quick melee. What the hell is that? Increases chance to obliterate enemies with ranged attacks at close range. Max 10%. Minus 15% enemy armor when using ranged attacks. Dismemberment spreads the effect to nearby enemies. That's crazy. Cool. We still have 12 perk points, which is great. Um, bullet spread one moving. I don't think we need that because we'll be shooting with a pistol. And then shotguns are just for like up close. Um, so adrenaline is indicated by a yellow bar and acts like extra health by absorbing damage. It also decays over time. So we'll grab that. We need that. Uh, because we'll also get a damage bonus. Whoa, when adrenaline rush is active, plus 50% adre 50 adrenaline on dismemberment of a nearby enemy. Sick. So we'll be hitting some things that are all gonna be bouncing off of each other. Uh, adrenaline has a decay. We might do that, but before that, I think we should do this actually. Army of one instead of, okay, we'll do both of those. Mm, no, we'll just do that. Army of one, reflex, midair. I just wanna get some stuff that's allows shooting while sprinting, sliding, and vaulting. How much do you really shoot when you're sprinting though? You know what I mean? I'd rather increase my vaulting speed. Shoot while dashing, that I can use. <clears throat> Eventually I'll get comfortable. Oh, pff, trust me. You should have seen me back in the day with a couple of throwing knives. Definitely stunt jock. 
Luckily, I've looked at these quite a bit, so I don't think we're actually like super behind schedule as far as how long this should take to do. Sounds weapons, no, no. Hip firing does not consume stamina. When focus is active, 25% moves. Jeez Louise, man, all right. Freaking getting that. Uh, gain in, in, immunity to movement penalties. Mm. We'll do that, we'll do that. That's, that seems pretty good. Fury Road, I almost wanna hit. I'm gonna have to get this to get to there though, which would take quite a few levels. So we might be, if we decide to get the throwing move, it's gonna be a second to get there, but we can get there. I'm gonna do Fury Road, um, just cause I don't like getting shot in my car a lot. We're gonna do that. So we haven't done anything with blunt weapons yet. We're, we're not going to for a second. I'll just get this just cause, what the hell, why not? All right, so we're full-blown countryman, it seems like. Yes, yeah, thank you. Yeah, um, yeah. CM Winter, two hours in and he hasn't started the DLC yet. Classic Jack, CM Winter, I always appreciate your feedback and support. <laughs> All right, we're good. Let's play this game. <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> Looking like a preem choom, thank you. I feel like I'm saying a slur there, but we're gonna move past it. All right, double barreled shotgun. This thing does 491 damage. If this doesn't blow some faces off, I don't know what the hell I'm doing with my life. Um, this is also the pistol I used, by the way, If in my last build. I should show you guys that. This dude, just freaking sniping people. Not a big deal. Okay, we got a revolver, Archangel. It's uh, apparently a pretty fast shooter, too. I think it's probably like one of the best revolvers in the game. Um, and then Katana. Man, it's kind of badass to have a throwing knife, but we're not going to do that. Um, we want to go to my car, which would be... Which car are we going to grab? Oh, dude, what am I saying? You got to have a motorcycle. Come on. Get my horse. Dude, one thing I uh, I will say, uh, talking about this motorcycle, freaking uh, power double barrel shot. What is this? Power revolver. Gotcha. I don't want to use Johnny's pistols just because I feel like it's overpowered in a lot of ways. Um, I will say about Jackie's motorcycle, uh, it reminded me of Jack E, which, dang, did he get killed off way too quickly in this game, I feel like. I really liked him. Um, what, compared, to, compared to the other fucking gun, what are we doing? They nerfed Johnny's pistol. That's what it feels like, because that thing was crazy. Thank you. There we go. Hey, we're drinking now, boys. Let's let's get it started. All right. Add a little light nickel. Good stuff. We put on the cowboy hat. We crack open a cold one. All right. Um, all right, let's settle down. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to throw that in there. I don't need any of that. I'm going to throw that in there. I think, I think we're gonna grab, what's her face, a sniper? Or maybe we'll wait for a sniper. We'll like, we'll earn a sniper. So we're just shotgun and pistol man right now. I think everything else we're good with. Right? Yeah, I think we're good. God, I really am almost two hours and I haven't played the game. <laughs> Whatever, I've killed a couple of guys here and there. 
I haven't done shit. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> let me know how the volume is, and uh, we'll get started. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. We do got to go to the cyberware place just to just to switch some things up. So funny, like th th that that game volume is so loud to me. I maybe here, th does that sound good to you guys? Because I'm gonna I'm gonna turn down my damn volume because like I can't even like start to talk. This is so loud in my headphones. Okay, levels. Let's turn down to like 66 percent or something. All right. Sounds perfect. Okay, and you guys can like still hear me. Hey, can you pull up the yeah. the thing? Okay. All right. So if I'm singing and I'm in oh, a I'm store, sorry. damn it. Ads, you know what I mean? Okay. Sorry. Just crack it in. Oh, hang on. I'm not doing anything right now. Nah, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> All right, let's get some new mods. I don't know. Okay, good. I still have like dashes and everything, and I believe. All right, we don't have any points available, but we got the midair. Okay, good. <clears throat> I'm looking for some cyberware. Hook me up. See all this stuff that I bought, dude. I literally just saved up like. Three hundred thousand dollars just to get this stuff. Why are you selling iconics? I didn't. I was selling uh, tier five. I didn't sell no iconic. I think you thought I did, but I didn't. Hmm. Have one. I was just so delayed. Yeah. Oh. How far behind is it? Oh, that's like so far behind. I just refreshed it, too. No, you gotta hit live. Cow. <laughs> <laughs> so confused. Why did you do that? <laughs> These are all quick hack shit. Dang it. Dag, flam it. Even my hands. Oh! That's actually kind of sick, right? Like, I'm pretty sure my guy... Oh, I have $102,000. <laughs> Man, turn me upside down and smack me around on the, the butt booty. I almost said pussy. <laughs> All right, it's because the game's so loud. Man, I was afraid he didn't slip. Um, so I got $100,000. <laughs> I must be the richest man in Kentucky. The... I think I know what to get for all those things. The thing I wanted to check, though. Fuck, what did I want to get? Let's get you chromed up, Chum. Thank you. Hands. Oh, oh, my gun, my gun, my gun. Duh. So it's a power, it's a power gun. And, and, uh, power weapons can ricochet. <laughs> I feel like I'm like, or do they? I think they do. Do revolvers ricochet? Because it's like super broken, apparently. This one's really good, but I've heard that the... Did they say Doomsayer? Why does CD Projekt Red make so many nods to Doom? Like, are they connected in some way? Let's see here. Yep. Sorry. Right. 
Minus 35% camera detection, how it's cameras and turrets, how it's explosive. No, this is all useless. I need the the cocoon eyes or whatever. They give me like 30% like crit chance. It's like insane. <clears throat> whatever. We'll just use these for now. Does full time equal more streams? Yes, it does. Definitely. I don't think I feel weird saying that that's a definite yes. Maybe even a schedule. I don't know. <laughs> Let's not get too crazy here. Holy shit. I just realized that gives 160 armor. That's wild. It is $61,000, though. Whew. Shucks. Yes, yeah, so there's a lot of, like, just armor crap. Okay, hands. Hands are important. Ricochet chance with power weapons. That's only 8,000 bucks, so I think we're gonna get that. Boom. Locked in. I believe one of these is recoil. Yeah. So that's good. Blood pump, good. Bio monitor, might as well. This thing, melee speed. Can we do anything other than that? That's cool here. 15% <clears throat> Stamina cost for shooting, that's probably what we want. Is a melee weapon, some rats, and health. That's good, but that's really pricey. Clutch padding. Boom. Good. We're do dude, we're we're a gunslinger now, man. Sheesh. I mean, yeah, this legs all the way. It's funny that I've used the green legs since like the very beginning of the game. Oh, you can try it. All right, that's cool. You can charge legs, increases sprint speed, starting at 50% and tapering off to 10%. I've heard that the new map though is like very um, uh, vertical. It's a lot of verticality to the map. Great word. I'm gonna attack from the side of the rear, we'll use that. I think these are all gonna be kind of weird. After dashing. I've never used the optical camo because I don't like hiding from my enemies. I ain't no coward. The less damage they deal to you, the closer they are attacking you. It's not terrible. Mitigation. This is all armor stuff. When you take damage, you have a 10% electric shock. Ooh! $61,000. Heck yeah. Heck no, we're not going to do that right now. Mm, how about this guy? It's 8,000, it's only, yeah, let's do that. Boom. We're managing, managing our money well. Or we're trying to, at least. Blades and throwable weapons. Successful takedowns. Very cool. Yes. Slows time by 30%. When I made detection reach. Oh, that's that's a must have. Entering combat. Uh slows time. Are these all slow time. Time mitigation. I was gonna aim and perform ranged attacks while sliding, dodging, or dashing. Allows you to aim and perform ranged attacks while sliding down. I already have a ability that lets me do that. <clears throat> Slow time by 60% for three seconds when you aim a range attack during a slide or a dash. Okay, that is... That is very cool. Fuck. That's very cool. Hmm. Crit chance. Far away from an enemy. That's good, but I'm pretty sure I start critting like crazy with the dead eye thing. This is cool, though. Slide, dodge, or dash. It's only 17 grand. <laughs> Toss it in the basket. Uh, this is all ram stuff, melee. Armor, that's good. Mitigation chance, armor, armor, carrying capacity, armor. Jeez. Minus 20% movement speed? Oh, and crouched. 
Below 50% health. 21,000. Yeah, I think we're good. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's huge. That's 43,000. We might get that. Because it's reducing stamina cost, which we might kind of want. This we don't even really need. I might use gorilla arms just because they look cool on my hands. Although they did ruin some story moments, I'm not gonna lie. Because you're coughing up blood, but if you have gorilla hands, none of the blood shows up on your hand. What do you guys think of this build so far? Is this crazy? You own tier five grill arms? I do? Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> Thank you. Cool. Good build. All right, thanks, Corey. <laughs> okay, and this is the last one, and then we're good. Uh, enhancing user speed and reflex. When so is this Kirasinafras? What is this? Karanazikazva. When you did it? okay, cool. So I can pair this together. I can boost it with seventeen Gs. Improves Karanazikaz. By enhancing the user's speed and reflexes, when character is active, minus 100% stamina cost from shooting slows time by 10% relative to your enemies. That's awesome. Boom. In. Plug me up. That, well, all right. 20% uh, <laughs> <laughs> damage against drones. Robots. Oh, that's good. It's like, all right. It's not that great. Ram speed, ram, ram. Negates enemy quick hat hack. Cyberware. Speed, 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 speed. I am speed. Hmm. What do we say this guy? We only got thirty-two grand left. Let's do that. Just cause you do run into drones here and there. And then carrying capacity? <laughs> I mean, might as well. I mean, I don't know what else we got. Oh my gosh, I didn't put a freaking operating system in there. Okay, good. Yo, that's clutch. We came in at the exact cyber, what is this called? Cyberware capacity. So we got the sand of his time, fish time. So we might be using the berserk. It's only a million dollars. I think I might have one actually in my trunk. Yeah. Ah, I want to be a friggin' space cowboy cyberpunk god. Sleeves rolled up. One more thing. One more thing right here. It's crucial. I can help you. I think it's a better mustache, though. Oh, oh, oh. Nope. How can I help? Then we're going to hit the hairstyle. You got to get the cowboy hairstyle, which I don't know what the hell is. Maybe that. <laughs> It's gotta be like, yeah, that that's a cowboy hairstyle. It's always like shitty <laughs> bedhead because they weren't a hat all day. <laughs> or it might be that. <laughs> Lover boy. I don't get how anyone has ever gotten this and thought it was a good idea. <laughs> how do you see? Oh, it, I mean, Talk about a southern boy. That's a southern gentleman right here. Boom. Oh. 
What color was that? It's the top one? Okay. Eyes, no. What did I? Oh, eyebrows. Come on. That's uh, those are way too thin for what what kind of problems we're gonna be dealing with. There we go. Right there. There's a Jack Saver eyebrows right there. See, so they kind of they kind of go out and then they they tape they kind of edge down. Very angular. Very trustworthy eyebrows. Okay. <laughs> That's what my hair looks like. What? What hairstyle did I get? Oh yeah, yeah, okay. Does that make sense? I feel like this is longer than I whatever. That's fine. <laughs> well. well. Now what do I do? <laughs> Alright. We got the revolve. We might want the mantis arms. The gorilla hands might just get a little in the way. We're never getting out of here. <laughs> also, did I get the frig? I might have gotten the thermal. All right, now we got the regular ones. Here we go. I'm never gonna use the mantis arm, so yeah, I might get a little fisticuffs. See, this is what's weird. Look at how weird my <laughs> player character is. My shadow. There you go. Now it don't look so weird, do it? Boom. Okay. See you, kid. Dang. Boom, boom, boom. What am I forgetting? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Sorry. Why is my guy black? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> What's going on here? Well, whatever. Shucks. All right, get the horse. What am I forgetting? Forgetting to play the game? Damn it, Rachel. Don't you calm down. It's high noon. Of course, the freaking car spawned all the way up there. Holding up traffic. All right. Roger. Requesting additional backup. Dispatch, do you copy? That's how you fool me. Go on the other. Off ramp. And you spin it right around. Dogtown border. I mean, boom, everything. Two. We don't have an E move. Which is very interesting. We don't have an E move. We don't have an E move. Do this. Volume's good. Because I'm going to turn down my... I'm going to turn up my mic, down my levels, though. There we go. So now I can hear myself again. Boom. Okay. There we go. Alright, it only took 2 hours and 12 minutes to start the game. I mean, I don't even know. We're not even at the checkpoint yet. Maybe we shouldn't even say that. go. I don't like how loud the... There you go. I want to be able to hear the roar of my bike. 
My motorcycle. Oh, maybe it's super loud, actually. I didn't think about that. Because I just turned down my volume, that's why. Duh. Like, is it super bassy? Is that? Okay. I just wanted you to hear it as well. Let's flip over my headphones. Okay. There we go. God, my hair is so freaking long. I gotta get a haircut before we film a cyberpunk video. Okay. Save. Video game. Should we fight anybody before going in here? Ugh. They look like a lot of guys. Are you guys mad if I like? Out of the way, now! No can do, but you both can fuck off. Wow. I'm NCPD in pursuit of a suspect who just fled into Dogtown. I, I thought I've been I able to go to this place this whole time. I I censored the game. How the fuck are you still showing up? How? Get out of my game! Cyber wheels or something? Feet on the sidewalk now. Yes, sir. Uh oh, relic detected. What you got in the back? So one thing I haven't thought about yet is the fact that I think Johnny is in this DLC. I imagine he is. By the way, oh, I mentioned mentioned this too. I beat the game, but then it reverts you back to your last save before like the last chapter kind of thing. So, um, I haven't finished the game in this save, if that makes sense. Like it reverted me back. And I definitely should have done this before beating the game because there's a different endings once you do this DLC. Look for Songbird, all right. What does she look like? Ah! No, fucking... no! I made Johnny Wear's alternate outfit? It looks terrible! What the... God, oh, it's like... Someone shoved my head in the place. B, ah! You're gonna be okay. Breathe deep. Count to ten. Recite a mantra. Whatever brings calm helps you stabilize. Your nervous system took a big hit. Broke down. Racing heart, cold sweat. It'll pass. The hell are you the doing to me? The fuck are you doing? This a trap? It's a helping hand. I know about the bomb ticking in your head. <laughs> if I could disarm it now, I would in a heartbeat. You'll feel better any second now. Be something stinks here. <laughs> Think she's she's fucking with the relic. <laughs> what are you? How in the all true, Johnny. But don't you fret. What? That's sweet. Don't say. No, fuck Both off. Both of us on the biochip protocol at once can trigger shocks for V, like it just saw now. Gotta cut you off. What? For your safety, for V It's a sweet effect. It sounds really good. Had to mute him for now. He hears you fine, just can't talk back. No, that's in the standard game. That's that's Fabio. Yeah, Fabio. Sorry, I just almost took your jog board, joke board, jorg borg. The um, yeah, it's it's a. Uh... Get along. No, sorry. I'm certain. You look like a construct. You a construct, like Johnny? No, V. Whoa. I'm a net runner. Hopped on the relics cognitive protocol to dial in. I see and hear what you do. So is Keanu? Part of this, or is Just he kicked now, out for a while? Board Space Force One, sitting right across from Rosalind Myers, 
president of the new United States of America. The president? Fuck. <laughs> I... She's the president? No. You're not joking. Dead serious, yes. The plane's been hacked. Trajectory set for Night City. They'll bring us down to Dogtown soon. Our comms are down, most likely jammed. The relic was my only option. Right now, you're one contact on the ground. Oh, you're with the president. Tell me the NUS president, Rosalind Myers, is there with you. Sitting right across from me. She knows the situation. Waiting for your yes. How do I help and how much time we got? Too little to avoid landing in Dogtown. Likely enough to minimize losses, save some folks. That's where you come in, V. The president's life, her safety, that's your top priority. She'll survive the landing. Dogtown, not so sure. You'll need to get her out of the plane before anyone else does. Nothing's free, including my help. Nothing's for free, Songbird. We should talk biz. Just got a taste of my abilities, I believe. There's more. I can cure you. Once and for all. Bullshit. I can't know how much I'd really love to believe you, but... I know, V. You've hit a dead end. Nowhere to turn. Been there. Believe me. You've had a... Consider this a... Multi-billion dollar biochip in your head that... With clusters of corrupted data. I'm done with that. Making room for stuff that'll actually be handy. Whoa. Such as... Some pre militech combat stuff. It's just lying around, gathering dust. New perk tree unlocked. You've unlocked the relic perk tree. To access the abilities it has to offer, you will need to acquire relic points, which are unique to only this perk tree. They can be found at Militech data terminals scattered around Dogtown. Data terms will appear on your map when you get near them. By downloading old Militech operational data and combat logs, you will earn a relic point that can be spent in the relic tree. Okay, cool. I've seen a video kind of breaking this down, so because of the building stuff or whatever. Feel my fingers tips uh, tingling. Tingling in my fingertips. Kind of nice, actually. Oh, it goes a lot further than tingling. Trust me. Now what? listen. What I gave you is the skeleton soft, but the firmware's fancy. It'll learn, grow with you. It'll improve if you feed it data. Combat analyses, logs of legendary ops, shit that make the NCPD piss its boots. Look around Dogtown. Got to get there first. Main entrance is a no-go. You don't have an entry pass, and I don't oh, have time to. Sphere hunters it. in here, Susie. In Jack, when you get to me, I already mentioned to you. I was like, I can't wait to see you in games. Jack, when you get to me, you better click on all my dialogue options. I'm going to try. You better not get mad at me for some random reason. Sometimes I feel like I click so, on stuff with Cyberpunk, and they just go a completely different direction. Either way, sorry. so. I'm talking you. to Susie. She's also in the I'll game. Be right beside you, as much as I can. Nope. Garage. There. Past the fence. See it? The old Smoke dumpster dive. Let's get now on in here. Time. Come on. Try to sneak in. Hey, look at my cowboy boots. Um, something. Nice. Alright. Do we just kill everyone? I would love to. What? This looks like the the beginning of like The Last of Us. I'm about to go kick the shit out of Derek. Nah, I don't want to run. Let's kill. I like it. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many. <laughs> Surround them. Go, go, go. Come on. Fucking trying. Woo. 
Hold up, hold up. One's behind me. <laughs> Obliterated. That feels so good, man. Come on, try me. This is this build is awesome. Holy shit. I am getting drilled though. <laughs> Where are you? Shit, shit, shit. I really did not need to miss that one. I'm gonna kill all of Dogtown. <laughs> Regroup squad. You better try. Jeez Louise, see that that delay on the uh, on the frame generation just like threw my shot right there. That's the only downside is when things get I mean this this intro entrance is like heavy on the frames anyway. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Is that you? Woo! Look at how many more there are on my mini-map. <laughs> so wild. No way! Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. No! That's some bull. Team Swag, we can see your messages. Use Sandy? Yeah, I know, I... Oh, is that why... Oh, I do have a, a thing. What am I saying? Garage. There. See, look at that. That's, That's the, the real frames See right it. there. Smugglers used to use it. Now it's your turn. Okay. Try to sneak in. Use the thing, got it. Alright. I don't know, something. Maybe try to distract the guards. Maybe kill them all. I'm gonna kill them all again. I, I'm... We're, we're, we're doing it my way. This is gonna be good. Really wish there was more stealth kill options. That'd be so sick. I wish I could do the old classic blow their head off and then keep fighting them. Poke. Do it. I dare you. He's got the guts, huh? Somebody's hit me like really hard. Might be that, might be that, might be that. Oh, it's the sniper. Fuck. That hurt like a bitch. He's got his freaking sight on me again. Lucky bastard. Fucking thing's gonna blow. <sighs> From the sides. Fucking try it. Oh. Oh. Ah. For fuck's sake. 
No! There we go. Jeez. Hey, you knock it off. That guy, right there. Got him. That's my main problem. Oh, no, no. Still one more. You ate this. Careful. Don't want to get popped. Boss, holy crap. Never mind, he's dead. Got him. <laughs> no. Where's that net runner? Where is he? Damn it. You got me, you got me. Cool off. All right, let's get, let's just get all this loot. Let's get out of here, let's pick up the guns. <laughs> just picturing my guy running out there and just grabbing guns while he's running. Oh, here he is. Be the net runner? You him? Where is I? Two of them. No, 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 no. All right, all right. We're gonna kill these guys. We're gonna get some more loot, and then we're gonna, then we're gonna jump. All right. Oh my gosh, my game. Holy fuck. Barely move, man. Holy shit. All right, it's getting too heavy. It's getting too much. Shit. I really thought there'd be a, a an ending point to this. I don't think there is. This guy. This fucking guy. No, 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 no. Come on, get him, get him, get him! Fuck. Just, that's bullshit, that's bullshit! That's bullshit! Get me out of here! No! 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 <laughs> Damn it. Okay, we should start playing the DLC. <laughs> uh. Cow poke sweating. Hell yeah. Ooh, there's a new sheriff in town. I'm gonna not kill everyone though. Jeez, dude, my game was like, what the hell are you doing? Smugglers used to use it. Now it's your turn. Would have been a sweat. We had to get some quick coin though. I don't know. Something. We might go with quick hacks though, because um
Because I kind of want to be able to control stuff still, and I don't think sand is super useful. We have so many slow motion abilities already. I wish I could slam guys' heads against, like, metal shit. I always get so dark in my fantasies about what I wish games would let me do sometimes, but it just would be a little, a little more satisfying than the old neck snap. Nobody notices me. Do the jump takedown? I haven't been able to do it correctly yet. I keep screwing it up every time I do it. I don't know what the deal is. Maybe it's like... I don't think you have to unlock anything. The jump takedown does slam their head in the concrete, though. You're right. Yes. Great. Now in you go. Look for a net access point. Jack in that, and I'll be able to help you. You should be one level lower. Eyes peeled. Look for a way down. Smart pistol. <laughs> Let me just move this here piece of sheet metal. Sheet metal. Now, look for a maintenance room. I feel like these there headphones always make me like slightly skew my words. And drinking probably doesn't help, but still. So. Ooh. Oh no, classic shoes, dress shoes, call it pilot fire cop, but give dirt. Fucking tarnation. It's getting very scary. Oh. Nice. Let me do one thing for myself real quick, folks. Turning up my microphone, my microphone volume. For myself. Damn it. There we go. Okay. I just, I hate messing with my mic volume because there's times where like, now I'm gonna like go into this tomorrow when all my volumes are down and I'm gonna start speaking. It's gonna blow out my eardrums. But I did want to be able to hear myself more because I keep slurring my words, not because of the drinking, it's because my headphones, I swear. Oh, start the generator. Jeez, I'm sorry. Come, come on, Jack. Get your head in the game. Turn something on. Nice, V. Exactly what we need. The old access point. Bingo. Right here. Okay, we're up. Perfect. Bridging systems now. Hmm. Ancient. No, proto-ancient protocols. Largely corrupted data. Give me a sec. Need to ping one of our sats. Let's see which active Dogtown network links to this infrastructure. And putting in a back door. Ready to roll. I thought she was Adam Smasher for a second. I was like, I thought I... Hop on the platform. I'll guide you to the garage from there. Alright, I'm on. Hang on. Okay. Roll a keg first. Then you slap the muzzle on Johnny. Then you bring some pile of scrap metal back to life. Oh yeah, don't I have uh do I have relics? <clears throat> so I got three available already. Uh improves camo. Okay, I don't really need that. Man displays. Dismembering an enemy or performing a finisher with Mantis Blades will charge the next leap attack. Oh, fuck. Of course. Does mass damage with a wide slash that hits the target and other enemies nearby. Hmm. Shockwave from a charged gorilla arms attack now knocks down all enemies. 
Miss Blades now cripple enemies and increase dismemberment chance. Is this all there is with Relic? You know, type vulnerabilities. The enemy armor and cyborg hitting vulnerabilities gives them a good chance of penetration. Dealing enough damage to a vulnerability will cause it to explode, generating an EMP blast that damages enemies within range. Spraying an enemy's vulnerability grants 10% frequency of new villa uh, appearing. Cool. Oh, that costed three? I've Serious trickery all. Who taught you? Fee, I'm an NUS intelligence analyst. I know the best peeps <clears throat> in the biz. And they took me on because around age 13, I got the local ripper to sell me a beatable deck. Rarely left an incense. I got noticed. The rest is history. Whoa. I got a feeling stories incomplete. Look at that. Maybe longer. More twisted. Apologize up front for the quarry, but I gotta ask. Compeki Plaza Heist. Why? <laughs> That's some real guff on my track record. I had a friend. We worked together. Partner. Gig was important to him. And he, uh... He was important to you. He didn't make it. He did not. <laughs> Jackie! Kermy! <laughs> what the? Jeez. You alive? Think so. Yeah, I'm alive. For a second. By the way, I would. Must have gotten old by now. Calling a faded rocker boy around. Strikes me as tiring. Not a silver hand fan, are you? Please. Samurai was done by their second album. That's really disrespectful. Wishes you the best of luck. How's she doing? Awful nice of you to ask. I laid out the details of our plan. Typical Rosalind. Keep me apprised, she says calmly. Just sitting there, sipping her gin, looking through her agenda, postponing meets. Woman's unshakable. And the violence crimes are at an all time high. Get that woman on the. Going to hell. Bright as the city side metro, huh? Reminds me of when I was starting out. Wait, I should I go this way? Like this. Set up power bypass, jack in. Essentially steal my way onto the net. Grab the riskiest gigs I could buy. Learning as I went. The hard way, usually. But sometimes, a few times, I really pulled off crews. Anything I'd find on BBS gossip feeds? Hmm. Biotechnica in 63 or 4. Fermentation facility in Oregon. Off the grid hack. Sound familiar? Hmm. Yeah. 
Sensing a buzzer. But you're nowhere near impressed. I just love the shading no, on the gun. No. Look at that red. This is my impressed oh. face. Uh huh. We're already rubbing elbows, man. I love it. I barely have heard anything she's saying, I'm not gonna lie, but she's a she was a kid at some point. That's all I heard. Anybody else do that on <laughs> like computers with messages? Just click right through them. <laughs> Dogtown in a minute. Try to steer clear of Hanson's goons. Speaking of Kurt Hanson, what else do you know about him? Hanson was an officer, Militech. Tail end of the Unification War, his unit was tasked with taking Night City. They managed to secure a foothold in <clears> the <throat> southmost pocket and stuck around. Refused to demobilize, laid down their weapons, found in Dogtown instead. Traded one conflict for another, basically. Hot or cold, no better way to make a buck than war. War never changes. Oh, I can take this. I can break these cuffs! Up the stairs, through storage. You should pop into the market. What in the hell? Is that a body? Or a pumpkin? Whoa. Major frame drop here. Holy fuck. Get your ammo. Oh, that might be why. This reminds me of like Metro. He's like an undead. Radical mods, June. Never seen anything like that on a non maelstrom. Uh, you mean this? Ain't seen nothing yet. Check this out. Well, this shit here. <laughs> what happened? Some kind of accident? There's a bunch of theories cyber psychosis, childhood accident, mind blast, body dysmorphia. Take your pick. And which one's the real one? Shark attack. Whichever one's gonna land me a sail. <laughs> uh, speaking of, uh, how can I help? Green collection. Ain't scared something will go off on its own. Object and wall. Kind of question is that? Cohesive connections and all that. Chill. All of these are your peripheries. Not afraid of an overload? <laughs> me? <laughs> afraid? No, 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 no way. Uh, maybe. I like this guy. Where'd you get that piece? Hey, a good deal never reveals their sources. I'm all about the lost, the found, and the taking. Make all your little dreams come true. Ooh. Which one is he talking about? Order? Do you got a sniper? I want to see how much money I'm supposed to raise. Whoa, Butcher's Cleaver. Gosh, of course it's like backfiring that I'm switching off of a uh, sword, mantis blade, knife build immediately. Oh, there is a sniper. Okay, great. Let's see. It's only a oh, fucking $114,000. That's so much money. My lord. 
The delay I'm getting right now is like, like guys, look at this. Let's turn off frame generation and see see what's going on here. You've come to the right place. This is the actual frame rate I'm getting. <laughs> That's wild. It's less than 20 frames. My 4070 Ti is getting less than 20 frames. 19. That's crazy. That's fucking wild. I'll turn I'll turn off ray tracing. Let's see what we get without ray tracing here. Okay. 44. It's funny. 44 feels way smoother than 19. With no ray tracing, I'm getting 14 frames a second. Or sorry, sorry. Four, without ray tracing, I'm getting 40 frames. Or now it's 50. Sometimes it takes a second I've noticed that like the ray tracing like needs to What do you do? Hey, 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 hey. So is Johnny on pause for this? I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't like pay Keanu Reeves to do like another whole thing if he was just like Sure, I'll give a line where I'm getting kicked out of their office. Heard wild stories about this place. Among vendors in Kabuki, it's downright legend. Is there? Okay. Seems the legend's true. Stalls here? Just the tip of a mammoth iceberg. Dive deeper and you'll find a truth that's much darker. Even downright disgusting. The heavy stuff, biggest deals, take place behind closed doors. Dogtown stadiums where the right buyers meet the right sellers. All right, I want ray tracing back on. Frame generation, and we're just gonna push through it. Hey. Alright, fine. Ooh. Come on, old blue, get in there. Sounds like Beastie Boys. Why does she look like blurry still? Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> it's part of the song. Fuck! Okay, we're gonna make a new save. Uh, I do want to exit the main menu real quick because I want to switch. Johnny's alternate outfit, and then we're gonna jump right back in. I just gotta pee while we're doing that. Just optimize your settings. Oh, trust me, man. This, this, these settings are optimized. I should do one thing, though. And if I notice something weird, we'll turn it off. I gotta keep that on high as well. Damn it. I've been playing with it off. Let's see. Gameplay, Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. There we go. Okay. I gotta pee.
decent selection. All right. Decent. Depends. Who's asking? What for? It's rock. If it's not, no street punk needs an upper for the night. This is Kurt Hansen. If you're hearing this, you've come to I the right place. I need someone who is not a smart person. Gang wars, not a dog town. Hi, I'm Jack. Michelle, nice to meet you. Yeah. I, I have a girlfriend. It's Panam. Sorry. As you abide by my rules. Is that fair to you? I thought so. That was a close one. She was all over me. Send the word space to seven two nine nine for a chance to win a one. You guys ever seen the anime movie uh, Breadline? I'm getting those vibes in this place right now. Why are you kids so close to the bar? Are you trying to snag a beer? Also, why do the people, why do kids in Cyberpunk look like shrunken humans? <laughs> Out of context, it sounds really dumb. Why do kids look like shrunken humans? Because they are. But they look like adults. They look shrunken adults. Yes, I'm talking to you. Are you getting what you want out of life? Let me guess. Food from a tube, rusty water from the tap. Another Red Line does rule. It's one of the best movies I've ever seen. Animated movies. All that behind. Far, far behind. Chief, talk to me. Jeez Louise, whatever. Whatever. I gotta get out of this place, dude. It's it is like seriously dragon. Whoa. Yes. The ang the deadliest customer. I mean that is. Can I just leave? Do I have to Sexy There you go. Very sexy. Strongest. That's that's those are those are plastic weights. Very cool. I thought I turned censoring on. This is Looking for some preem threads. Preem, you're in the right place. Twenty-three thousand bucks. Unitard. Yo. Magazine chest holder, absolutely. What else do we got here? What in the hell is that? VR goggles. Dude, I didn't realize there was going to be so much more, so many more new, uh, like outfit stuffs. And flash helmet that's dope i blow so much money on clothes in this game it's ridiculous i don't even know why why do i punish myself like this i'm basically just getting like everything black i know i'm not gonna wear these dress kind of things Let's see what the unitard looks like all right that's it that's all i need not in dog town I'd like to use your services. I just want to see what some of this stuff looks like. Four. Jeez Louise. 20 frames in the character customization menu? Oh, this, this outfit doesn't work anymore because of the, the hair. Too clean cut. All right, let's throw on classic pants. Very nice. Clean. Unitard. Is this female? Yeah, it's, it's, well, no, that's kind of like a wrestler. It's a unitard. This looks like a garbage shirt. Very nice. Pay some homage to Johnny. Chess holster. 
It's pretty slick. You would look badass with this. Those aren't bad, but I was thinking more. I was thinking more cowboy boots. Come on. Shirt underneath. Not terrible. Not terrible. Well, <laughs> shucks. It's a damn fine look. Damn fine look. It's funny that I said like 30 minutes ago that I was going to have one look my entire game play and then I'm already switching it back to this stuff. Come on, Jack. Get your head in the game. Just wanted to see a couple of these things. Wanted to see the baklava. Balaclava. It's better than what we had earlier. Not this outfit. The, uh... I was talking about this little hood thing. Pretty tis light. Not gonna lie. I mean, shoot, it's a strong outfit. That's if I'm doing doing some dark business. I like it. This is what I have on now. I mean, that's cowboy, but that ain't, that ain't what's going on right here. Dead eye. Boom, let's hit it. In Dogtown, I keep your business safe. As long as you're all right, we spent all of our money right there and there's another clothing guy right, did just get punched? Ooh, hey, oh, jeez. You, you let me go? Oh, I would. Problem is, you don't listen. Believe I told you. Dogtown in a nutshell for you. Oh, so you are going to leave him alone. Transfer creds to win a prize. Wardrobe randomizer. What'd I get? Was this clearance shit? Dude. I'm struggling, guys. I'm struggling. 18 frames. This is not good. What is my guy's outfit without uh, any clothes on? Oh, he's actually kind of cool. With any outfit on, is <clears throat> what I meant. <laughs> That's pretty wild. Twenty armor. Oh, I don't get anything from that. Health item recharge speed. Using that. Explosion damage. It's a big ass helmet, holy crap. Explosion damage. Alright, I don't look like a complete <clears throat> buffoon. It's funny that my other outfit... No, we'll just keep this one on. 
God. God. This is like basically my relic malfunctioning, but for me in real life. Shopping for iron. Personal use or wholesale? Looking to buy yourself an early Christmas present or equip a small army? Whatever your needs, we can meet them. Got Personal it. use. Say no more. Ooh. $122,000. Power sniper rifle. Metal power revolver. That looks sick. Okay, it looks like we're like choosing some good stuff actually. Nice. Yeah, do any of my stuff. Uh, can I put mods on any of these? So I can put a scope on that. Don't really need that. Kind of like the iron look on uh, this guy. No, experiment chance. Wow, that's great. So he ordered. Still had to. Then he's got a better off. 3,000 eddies going once. Going three. So again, six comes about the drop. I pay you. M22 for 3,000. V, um, been meaning to ask. Wow. How bad is it for you? Love it. Clock's ticking, but I ain't going to know. Clock's ticking, and fast. Relic will finish me, sooner rather than later. But you're here, looking for a means to survive. Still fighting. Think you'd do anything for another chance? Can't deny it. Chin up. We're in this together. There is that. I'm gonna try to start moving through the story because uh, I feel like I've been been uh, fuck dog. Think Henson's personal around protection too long. takes five minutes and a handshake to lock down. Shake, don't shake. I don't fucking care. I'm. A See, it is crazy though. It's like that whole scene, this whole scene, these guys talking to each other, me and Songbird overlooking. The, uh, none of that happened in Starfield, man. None of it. to con Biotechnica execs. Hansen's dog, get lost! Oh, I don't remember Biotechnica stringing people up by the balls. Oh, they did, but out of sight, so out of mind. Don't tell me you missed that life. Shit, you know what I miss? Organic hand-ground coffee. All right, these guys are talking about biscuits All and right. coffee. Time you got up on the roof. The hell for? For the view. And I'm not being coy here. I mean, you'll see where we land, literally. But I miss them most. Not the car, not even the Fuck! Can't you see I'm busy? All right. Small price to pay for your life. Mm. Your peace of mind. Let those corporal fucks stab each other in the backs with atos. Now, stop your bitching and get this tech. Get lost! Sorry. Keep talking. Not here. Oh, oh, oh. I did not factor in that I'm going to be getting like different versions of things like weapons, gear, clothing, all that kind of stuff. Like, I think there's going to be more stuff to analyze. Luckily, I did mod it to where I can just reset my uh, attributes, and I can do it off stream if I um if I want. But shooting around with the uh, revolver and shotgun, that was a lot of fun, so I'm probably gonna keep it. Woo! 
What is this, like a big spaceship? Take the elevator. Yeah, why not? That looks safe. Blue circuit. I've lost access. What now? Try and restart the generator. Sorry. Where's the... There we go. Problem. You keep breaking shit. Damn, that my guy really knew what he was dealing with the generator. <laughs> or you hack rough and the hardware don't like it. Finally. That's what the country in. teaches you. FYI, we're about to cross into Night City airspace. Might be a bit of a shock. Braced for it. Whatever comes this is crazy that Idris Elba is like sure at, coming in at some point. I can't wait. Dogtown of all places, but having you means my chances are looking up. I always wonder what that green light is. People play this game without the double. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> I was about to say, how can they not play it without the double jump? But mine's deactivated right now for some reason. Wait, oh, damn it! I wanted to see that. You made it. Good. How's the city on board? Is this is like Stay a big roll. stadium. The tensions rising, unsurprisingly. See that? It's us, Space Force One. We're descending, and for a rough. Oh fuck! What? What's going on? What the hell? Whoa! 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 Keanu comes in. What the fuck was that, Samurai? Songbird, thought you might have. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, I know, I know. Songbird the cat. Life number nine commenced. Alas, I made sure to get Myers to the safe room before I ejected. Run to the wreckage bay. Save her. Right. On my way. Just be careful. Hanson said his goons. You need to hurry. What then? Got a plan? Find Myers. Get her to Liz Crestry. It'll be the safest spot in Dogtown right now. I like motion blur in a lot of games, but uh, 
Guys, I'm just, I'm just, the game's a little struggling right now. It's just a little too much. I mean, I'm sure it'll, it'll ease up, but right now I'm just gonna like mess with some stuff because <clears throat> I'm getting kind of like destroyed. Right. I'll be in touch. Godspeed, Bean. Friggin' dirty Harry rocking in. Oh, those new vulnerable points. The only vulnerable. The only. Dang it, I can't really. The only. The, the only vulnerable point I know is the head. <laughs> like that. Thank you. Don't worry, I don't kill civilians. Unless there's no cops around. Are there any cops here? This quest is time sensitive? Fuck off, no way. Focus now. You won't pass this way without a fight. You're capable, I know. But I'd rather not take any chances. So stay low. Go around. God damn it, you guys. Is it really? You can actually fail this quest right here and miss the whole DLC. No way. Alright, I'm sprinting through this, but I am gonna kill some people. Ready guys, speed run. Right here. Songbird, thought you might have. Fuck! Yeah, I know, I know. Songbird the cat. Life number nine commenced. Alas. I made sure to get Myers to the safe room before I ejected. Run to the right, B. Save her! Right. He's on my way. Just be careful. Hands and set his goons. You need to hurry. What then? Got a plan? By Myers? Get her to Liz Crestry. It'll be the safest spot in downtown right now. Right. I'll be in touch. Godspeed, B. Are you kidding me? Jeez Louise. Fuck it. He's a psycho. Oh, 
focus now. You won't pass this way without a fight. I run right now. What the hell? Did I hit G or something? You're kidding me. Sorry, I've been talking, guys. I've been <clears throat> focused as shit. Get inside quick. Fuel tank's insulated. It won't explode. See anything? A whole lot of wrecked aircraft. 
Anyone alive? Nobody jumped out to greet me. Shit! Are we too late? Deep reds. Nothing's for sure. Let me scan around. Keep moving back. You'll see a safe room. I'll pop the release on the door. Oh, she's the president? Russell Myers, you're looking at the solution to your current problems. Name's V. Uh, corny as it sounds. My favorite letter of the alphabet just now. Apologies. What? I had to be <laughs> sure it was really you. Right. But still to <laughs> I'm Jack. It's a favorite letter of my alphabet. Fucking hell. No, I did I did hit F. I, I, I chose the puncher. I hadn't identified that she was a woman yet. Jesus. There's gotta be a way, like, can I fucking get closer? That was rad. You there? How's the switch? We're alive. Both of us. Now listen. Head for the vacant building on- Elizabeth Chris. Got it. <laughs> Give me some credit. It's the best place to lay low. No heat signatures, so it's empty. Not a soul inside. Now get moving. The game gonna do one of these things where it's like, hey, if you didn't check the room that she was in, there was a legendary weapon that's best in the game. Take no survivors. Got Songbird on comms. She's fine. Found us a safe house nearby, too. Songbird. Had started to work. Sorry. I suppose I forgot she always lands on her feet. A crazy luck, both of you. 
Huh. Maybe you brought it with you. Alright, turn back on ray tracing. Like the all the effects. <laughs> There's such a bad joke I want to make right now, but it's like, so w this is what the world's like when we have a woman president. <laughs> sorry, sorry, come on, it's a country boy hat. It's all right, sorry. <laughs> just joking, just joking. At least she can some kick some ass. Nightmare. My people dead. All of them. Because of me. No. I guess this is gonna be an ass thing. Keep it together, sure. lady. <laughs> so wake up. Look alive. As if it were that easy. You have no idea how deep this goes. We were hacked. It means Hansen had help. From Washington. The NUS government is I don't know who Hansen is yet, but that I have a feeling it's easy to hit the ground at Dogtown. It should be very unless, cool. Unless. Unless the plot goes deeper. Hansen spreading his agitprop lies as we speak. I'm sure of it. Our people will have an even harder time crossing the border. I can't trust a soul. <laughs> True. Got no idea how deep this shit goes myself. Can you romance the president? Though, the falling apart won't help. Keep it together. Only way you'll survive. I'm afraid yanking my emotional bootstraps won't cut it. Let's give it a shot anyway. We stick to the plan. After that, guess we'll see. Wait a second. Damn it. I'm also slightly worried <clears throat> that I'm playing this game. Yeah, I'm playing the DLC after. If Hansen's got well. someone inside in Washington, that means I'm traceable. Wherever, whenever. What she got? Oh no. I have way. a subdermal tracker. It needs to go ASAP. Yes. It's near an artery that's best not nicked. I'll need your help. Um, I'm wondering <clears throat> if uh I'm playing the game like the DLC almost a little too late. Because uh, the sorry, I just got distracted by my. Give me a hand whatever. here. Whatever. The um, because my guns and stuff are so damn powerful. I don't know how much stronger they should get. If you know what I'm saying, like I mean, maybe I can increase. It's very difficult, but like I think they're already maxed out. It just stinks. I, I think I, there's a feeling in me that I'm not sure if I'm gonna get. Mm, more upgrades, really. I'll have the sniper, and then there is a cool revolver that I saw, so I'm, maybe I'm wrong, but yeah. Give me a hand here. Gonna hurt like a motherfucker, this. They say pain's a deal between body and brain. You can break it. Do you think that's the Swedish pain away. developers Buried. that, the reason why they say that, they say that a lot, lot in this shit. game. Like, they, they, they don't options. talk, maybe it's... Carve away. But it'll, it'll be like, this is like, uh, they say this at the end. It's almost like the way like Canadians say A. They'll say like, it's almost like British. How did he just say it right there? It's like, give me a hand here. This is gonna hurt this. Like, not this is gonna hurt. Or th it's gonna hurt this. They'll, they'll say this is good. Like, I, I would say this is gonna hurt. You know what I'm saying? They say that all the time in this game. I've noticed that. Close your eyes. Think of some asshole you hate. Always helps. Ugh. Woo. Ugh. That's a long list. Even better. Wait, is that drone? Finish up quick. <laughs> Cover it now. They can see 
Oh, that is a tech that it can be a Texas accent. <laughs> it's gonna hurt this. This is some fucking nightmare. My people dead. All of them. Because of me. Whoa, whoa. Kurt Hansen killed them. Not you. <sighs> is that what you think? Oh, you never mind. No I should have taken the dick answer. We were hacked. It means Hansen had help. From Washington. Let's get over here and let me slit your throat. The NUS government is aware of the crash. The no back of it. <clears throat> sat mapped it. Seen us hit the ground in Dogtown. Unless... Unless the plot goes deeper. Hansen spreading his agitprop lies as we speak. I'm sure of it. Our people will have an even harder time crossing the border. I can't trust a soul. I just... Fuck! I don't know what to do. True. Got no idea how deep this shit goes myself. Do know, though, that falling apart won't help. Keep it together. Only way you'll survive. I'm afraid yanking my emotional bootstraps won't cut it. Let's give it a shot anyway. We stick to the plan. After that, guess we'll see. That's my guy looks like. That's who's talking right now. Just want to remind everybody. <laughs> After that, I guess we'll see. Wait a second. Damn it. Yes, I don't want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't. No spoilers in the chat. No spoilers in the chat. Get it out of there. I'm traceable. Wherever, whenever. I have a subdermal tracker. It needs to go ASAP. It's near an artery that's best not nicked. I'll need your help. Gonna hurt this. Jibbing the prez with a tracker? Weird. Safety precaution. Congress. Guess I ever wanted to ditch the White House. Go on an all night bender. Can you help? Gonna hurt like a motherfucker, this. They say pain's a deal between body and brain. You can break it, throw the pain away, bury it. Whole lot of horseshit, but we're out of options. Carve away. Offline in a millisec. Next stop, Greenland, in your new buckwheat tilling life. <sighs> buckwheat tilling. <laughs> I wish it were that simple. <laughs> yeah. Wait, Same. is that drone? Finish up quick. Oh, shit. Cover it now. Shit, they can see us. Okay, how the fuck am I not supposed to be seen by that? <laughs> yes, I am cheesing this. Stay that way. You need to get to the top of the building. Talk later. Got Songbird on comms. Says we gotta climb higher. Lead the way. It's your city after all. That's no, not. It's yours. Try to haul ass. Ask our guardian angel if she can get this elevator moving. Elevator could use a runner's touch, Song. Already on it. Uh huh. Sorry, V. My magic's no good here. What we need's power. There's a maintenance shaft with a fuse box nearby. Follow the scaffolding. Says I need to turn the lights back on. Might take a minute. Fine. I'll keep my head down. 
Boy knows his way around a fuse box. Do you think it'll work? That's the place to get stuck. Just one way to find out. the probability a random passerby noticed a moving elevator in an abandoned hotel? <laughs> right. Leave the analytics to Songbird. Little fuckers are fidgety. Sharp sensors on those. If they've sensed us already, the place will be swarming in no time. President and the Drone Whisperer. One picks up things in the army, in spite of oneself. There's only one surefire way to get past this model. Move fast. Surefire sounds plain ominous. Running's hardly a plan. Dang, she's but been I doing all this in heels. Yeah, dude, Dogtown is sick. I was not expecting it to be this like big already. I don't know what I was expecting. Left. Give away your position. Something best avoided. Fine. I'll be quiet for a second. Enemy patrol. Where'd that fucker go? Get like I get so lucky because of that slow motion thing. You guys wanna see if I can jump off and assassinate? What strat gaming is in here? Gotta get the little ones to sleep. Just wanted to pop in and thumbs up the stream. Hell yeah, thanks strat. Thanks for all the amazing videos. Thank you, dude. Whoa. All right, here we go. Here it is. Son of a bee sting. Madam President, you're gonna... Your heels are gonna give us away. Fuck off with that. Fuck off with that. Whatever. It was a silence revolver. Okay, no it wasn't. I'm sorry, I lied. For shit's sake. If they catch us out here, we're dead. Roll the roof, huh? Why? Oh, it's stupid. It's not just your life. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Four wheels, two seats. Oh. Did your boy just cop a new sniper? Yikes. Yes, I did. Woo. What we got here. And we got a bougie ass friggin' tech submachine gun. Is this submachine gun? Yeah, it is. 
What is hitting me so fucking hard? Oh, it might be that guy. If I died right there. It's crazy what the base is. Is it is it loud? Okay. Still gonna wake up Alex. Give away your position. Something best avoided. Okay. Let's try this again. See? Grow the fuck up. I really need to get a silenced <coughs> revolver. Can I put you in here? <gasps> I can force that open though. Force the shit out of that open. Madam President, get in the air duct. Don't be a hero. Perfect. Now, stairs to the parking lot. Go. Your chariot awaits. A car? Not exactly inconspicuous. Best option you have. You'll oh see. Oh my gosh, if he finds me... Clutch. Damn it! It's freaking rare now. I killed you in another life. I think he'll turn this way. You're kidding me. What? No witnesses. Wait, wait, wait. Will I be playing Spider-Man 2 or reviewing it? I don't have a PS5, guys. I which sucks. Is that not like it's not for PC, right? It's it's PS5 exclusive for a minute. 
which does suck. It's very sucky. Fucker open fire. I, what the hell? <laughs> That's just staring at you for like 20 seconds. <laughs> Calls coming from inside the house. <laughs> Oh, is it the body that they're seeing? No, it's not. <laughs> Don't mind us, guys. Just the president walking through. Detecting multiple patrol six V. Stay on your toes. We have a plan. We need to stick to Elizabeth Crestry. That's where you need to go. The rats. Gotta make power moves too, you know? You'll take old metro tunnels. By the nearest station but you can abandon extra hall. What? Copy that. Brief Myers. We should all be on the same page. Songbird's leading us to a metro tunnel. Need to pass through an expo hall. I think I know the one. Scumbags won't let up. Lose them before accessing the garage. Target's motorized. Call the street. Don't let them escape. The badass Valerian. Oh, sorry, Madam President. I'm an idiot. Yo, patrol. The fuck's going on? Waiting on a sick. Outpost. Best go around. Is my water level gonna go away anytime soon or what he crawl into a hole or something? Yeah, like Drop us, we are gone. Over now. Good thing you grabbed the wheel. Looks clear. Finally. Nice change. You all nuke this place? You all? First time I'm here. Likewise. And if I never make it back, it'll be too soon. Shoot Songbird. <laughs> Looks like a kind of museum. <laughs> museum of wishful thinking. Where the rich bought and sold so many unfulfilled dreams. You're the rich. The building seems to be in good shape. <laughs> for a dog town, at least. Strange, isn't it? Maybe Hansen found some rich fools to fund his whims. No need to delay.
so quiet Whoa. I can hear my chrome creak. That's why it's a good sign. Also, think so. don't talk about your chrome in front of me, it's not ladylike. Feel free to ask her about those exhibits. Really wonder what she'll say. Hey, what's with this guy? Monument to a certain someone's bloated ego. <laughs> Takes one to know one. I know we're talking about the fucking president. <laughs> Damn. No way around this. Somber, got a sitch. Can you jimmy the door? Mm -hmm. On it. Oh, the lock jam. Got to brute force it. Uh, try this. <laughs> Time to roll up your sleeves. I just did that. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. Head for the elevator, just across the room. Hold up, hold up. Uh, one of Hampton's warehouses, it seems. Got to find an elevator, other side of the room. Amo City, baby. I like how everything needs to be neonified, even the ancient pharaoh statues. <laughs> Guys, can we not touch this one? This is no time to stop and think. Hmm. Never have. Oh, football. Now we're talking. I love sports. What is it? Let's move, please. This is no time to stop and think. This is no time to stop and think. All right. Okay, here goes. V. Do you hear that? Shit. Bastard's caught up to us again. Songbird. Can I please hey, attack these guys this time? this time? I don't have to be Heads fucking stealthy every two sight. seconds. Assault incoming. You probably got spotted outside. Either way, get ready. What now? Got a surprise for our guests. Making the final adjustments now. Busy for a second. Need that. Myers, we gotta engage him. Song's on the case. Really pull that off. Ooh, your boy can fly. Come on. Damn it. Okay, no, I can't. To heat up in here, Songbird. Working on it. Hold on tight. Oh. On my way. Almost there. Still no pepper. Over. 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 Over.
Squad one. Wait, let me get the. Songbird? What's with you? What the hell is going on, V? Dunno. Song's having a fit or something. Ah, it's not good. I'd get away, Madam President. Son of a bitch went haywire! For fuck's sake, Zomi! Slap a muzzle on the thing! This way! Quick! Through here! Ah! On, I can't baby. dash for some reason! Damn, my bat's gonna do shit. Dude, if I'm running 30 frames with frame generation, who the fuck is running this game right? Up here. Escalator, go. Jeez Louise. Oh, shit. That's so cool, though. All right, whatever. Fucking move, damn it! There, got it. Elevate on the way. Stay low till it gets you. God fucking damn it! Any cool loot around here? Madam, see any clothes? Ice cold ah. delivery. What now? Woo -hoo. You're not dying on me today. <laughs> nope. Guess not. Right. Good. We take it out. The fall did. About time we caught a break. Uh, can't stay here. Are you mobile? I knew it.
No way, did I get zeroed? Oh, you gotta be freaking... We're gonna go for balanced if we can. I'm not sure if that's allowed. But we're gonna do that. And we even did turn down that down to Anything in this house. <laughs> <laughs> like, like a touch. You know? Yeah. Oh, I know. Yeah. Like it honestly sounded kind of cool, but I was like, eh. I feel like. Well, I swear, what's weird is like, I think my bass. If I turn off my top speakers, the bass for the lower speakers like increases. Sorry, if I turn off the volume from my monitors, the the subwoofer like ink. I think it's just the fact that it's taking away the volume and it appears that way to me. But yeah, yeah, it's yeah. weird. Sorry, guys, I had an offline conversation. I mean, Jesus, I'm still running 36 fucking frames. No worry tracing. Drop. That good? 152 frames. Holy oh, shit, that's a ton. 152. Fuck. Game still looks really fucking good. <laughs> I'ma fucking destroy you. You gotta think about the puddles, guys. That's all I'm saying. Where is it? Where it hurts? <laughs> Step away from it. Shit! The turret! Head low! What do you mean? What do you mean head low? It is, isn't a sentence, Jim. Come on, you son of a bitch! Face me! Hey, watch out! That's why we got the mech killing thing. You die already. Doing like a thousand damage per hit right now. Keep it safe. 
That I had mantis arms. Give it a chase. Rust and piss, shit bot. Classic. I play done. Good fucking rings. Tell me about it. Safeguarding the nation. My ass. Yeah. Yeah. Close call that. <laughs> close call that. That was a close call. Did anybody, does nobody see what I'm saying here? Who are you talking to? Grab what you can, and let's head out. There has to be an exit here, somewhere. Try this one. Huh. What's this? Good stuff. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Dead quiet. Still. Not good. I wish she just said that sound. She was like, oh, not good. <laughs> Come on! Fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? Hold up, V. Let's pause. Think for a sec. What's Thought we didn't have time to think. I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Yeah. Okay, gonna give it a shot. Council Peasant 2. Thank you for the two dollars. Thank you. That guy was pissing everybody off. Yeah, I, I, I didn't see what was being said. I just saw ats, and I was like, alright, let's get out of there. <laughs> Guess you got me and only me. What? Great to see you again, Johnny. Curb the enthusiasm, kid. Never know. Could need me. See, what was said right there? I actually am excited to see Johnny, and I wish, like, he could hear my enthusiasm. Like, there's multiple times in Cyberpunk where I say what I want to say, but then it's like the delivery is like, great, now that you showed up, asshole. It's like, no, no, I meant, like, I'm stoked so, to see you. Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. Let me... I, I might want to reload that. Yeah, okay. Sorry. I was a little out of it for a second. <laughs> I 
Good teamwork. And luck. A pile of luck, me. Was somebody saying that that animation was could have been like any uh, arm thing that I had? Because the animation did look a little weird. <laughs> What's this? What is this? Boom. Good stuff. Oh. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Dead quiet. Still. Not good. Come on! Fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? I think I'm already past 70 affinity with, with him. I'm like about 85, right? <clears throat> Dude fucking loves me. Did you buy it? Yes. Yes, Cyberpunk's very much worth it. I, I'm, I've been having like hours of fun and actually wanting to play the game, which, man, it's, it's a breath of fresh air having that. Yeah, I think I am going to use this. And I think we still got to get feline footwork, but... I think we should just get, get to 20 there. Oh, did I use my perk point? Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, here we go. Fifteen percent movement speed, is it worth it? No compared to one percent. I keep like getting real low on health. Who's there? Oh, is that ricochet? That Let's pause. That's cool. Think for a sec. What's eating you? I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Stopping's not a good idea. We get pinned down, we're ground synth beef. Exactly. But so me can guide us out of this death trap. Call her, please. Okay, gonna give it a shot. Beat a songbird. Starting to worry us, girl. Song, are you there? No answer, huh? Guess you got me and only me. Long time no see, Johnny. You all good? Me? <laughs> Should be asking about Songbird. So? Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. But I got my best buddy back! <laughs> <laughs> what happened back there? With so me? to say all happened in a blink no one thing for sure she was terrified like she had her worst fears boxed up and that box popped open couldn't have said it better i'm not sure i understand you and me both somi's had occasional off moments lately temporary slumps but i'm sure she's headed where we're headed same destination she gave us it's the reasonable thing to do. Right. Reasonable. Girl's gonna have a hell of a hangover. If she wakes up. <laughs> Susie, is it like insane for you to be in the same game as fucking Keanu Reeves? That must be wild. Shit time for jokes. How you figure that? Cause I wound up at the same rave she went to. Felt like I was underwater. 
leagues down. Tried to surface, but this suffocating, sucking sound pulled me back in. How we do ben it? I have no money. The I am Chimera. The water turned into fucking boiling tar. Seems the sitch spiraled out of control. Amen to that. Though actually, could have been a straight overload. Seen runners caught in those. Shit's ugly. So, can we move on? Yep. Just like that. He's gone. She's like, who's that? I'm like, oh, actually, no. I could say that the songbird, because she can see it. I'd be like, hey, you'll get used to that. Like in Batman, The Dark Knight. Um, okay. How we do it with a $5 donation? I have no money. I'm going to miss my rent because of this, but you are going to kill it streaming and tubing full time, so enjoy me paying for a Big Mac. Your sacrifice is not in vain. Thank you, though. We're heading southwest now. Feels like we're circling back. Yeah, saw mention an abandoned building. Place to lie low. No heat sick. Should be relatively safe. I pray you're right, so me. <clears throat> so you guys know that I'm uh I'm rocking the 49 inch monitor or whatever. It's like extremely long. It's like the super ultra wide. And I dig it a lot. But I am thinking about switching to, um, especially because of streaming, I'm thinking about switching to a, to a two monitor system that's a regular ultra wide and a, uh, like a 2K monitor, uh, 16 by nine. Because I think you just, it's, it'd just be such a, such less of a headache to use than and also there's like some like coloring things like for editing that <clears throat> like I want to get like an IPS panel and all that jazz. But it's funny, like for streaming specifically, it's like there's I just no think it'd be think. much cleaner having a, uh, a screen I don't have to play in windowed mode. And like that's like the number one thing that's like the sacrifice of this monitor. But I do have a really sick setup that like there's there's no. <sighs> At the same time, as soon as I bring it up, I'm like, no I should, delay. I should just, all right, all right. Now you don't want to. Now there's no delay, but we have time to talk. But we don't have time to talk. But now we got to kill the chimera. What? Make up your mind, lady. The, um, but yeah, it's really interesting. The, what's well, I was, I was just about to criticize myself, what which is, is like, let's move, please. This is, this is, this is more than enough. I shouldn't have to do uh, any more changes, but uh, I have been thinking about it. <clears throat> Could use a little help. Of course. Oh. A damn fork? Well, we didn't account for this. Which way now? <clears throat> Thoughts? Split up. I like this one for its puddles. Let's try this way. Looks promising. Huh, our stop. On the right, see it? Here's where we surface. Christ, finally. Mm, I'm gonna smell musty for a week. I wanna see Idris so bad, dude. Nope. No way through there. Waste of time. All these tunnels are unfinished. You're not coming down here? No. Oh. Look at those water graphics. 
it's nice. Can I drive the forklift? I've got my thing. I can't I can't make it move. Or can I? Yep, that was really easy. So far so good. Uh oh. Not in the middle of a puddle. Elizabeth Chris Street. Bull headed Betty. That's what we called her. Re elected nine times. Please? She must have had her ass welded to that seat. Funny how she has her own street in Night City of all places. That jealousy I'm detecting? Please. Jealous of what? I think that V's just talking to the president this way. I totally wouldn't be nervous at all. Yo, what up, Priz? Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> not now! V, are you? Oh, one sec! It'll pass. Oh. See? Better already. What's the matter? Look at them Are standing there like the Grim Reaper. It's nothing. It's nothing. Really. Hey, please. I have a highly honed nose for bullshit. Got a experimental Arasaka biochip in my brain. It's killing me. Literally. So me says she might have a solution. Wait, you're talking about the relic. That'd be the one. The secretive tech someone stole from Arasaka. On the day Saburo lost his battle with mortality, no less. Bingo. So that's how she could reach you. It also goes a long way toward explaining the nature of your deal. I appreciate the candor. Seems it's all for one and one for all, if we're to survive. We've been going up that whole time while she was talking. Fuck. Expecting more trouble? Tonight? I expect nothing but. It's best to be prepared for any contingency. Okay, this is us, safe. Good place for an ambush. Hopefully, no one else thinks so. Ooh! I thought I was just gonna go in. <clears throat> Pitch fucking black. Where are you, so me? Huh. Guess we got here first. Seems so. We'll have to sit tight. Though I assume we'd rather not sit in the dark. Power would be useful. I could also get the radio up and running. What? Am I our daily dose of fear mongering? We need to know the situation on the ground. Am I about to have sex with the president? I'm gonna change out of this mess. High time. I totally am. Change. Into those filthy old rags. These filthy old rags won't be smeared all over every TV and terminal screen in the city. Unlike my presidential best. Have a look around. I'll join you in a minute. Pile of clothes, soon to be presidential pile of clothes. <sighs> I 
<laughs> saying that like the line of Nicholas K or uh, National Treasure. I've got to steal the Declaration of the Independence. Of the Independence, oh my god, my fucking headphones. I can't hear myself quite as good, so I can't make a cool line. I'll, all I was going to do is compare that to being like, I'm going to bang the President of the United States. <laughs> Check this, V. Attempted postmodern art. Check it out. More like a home cooked generator. Maybe we kickstart it. Literally. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> you imagine Keanu Reeves saying that line in, in the studio. Oh, shit. Uh huh. It needs a little go go juice to wake up. Sure, but seeing as we got a lull in the lead pouring down on us. Listen, got a bad vibe about this. You? Makes two of us. Gig's got too many twists and turns. Songbird, S-tier netrunner, promises a panaceum, a cure-all, then gets wiped off the map. Myers, shady politico, got a dagger thrown at her back all the way from Washington. Who by and why? Fuck if we know. Oh. Plus Kurt Hansen and this fucking Sam launcher. Just preem. Got this hot itchy feeling in my groin. Like someone's not fessed up to something. One thing's sure. Plot runs Mariana trench deep. We'll cobble together the full picture. Piece by piece if needed. More like rest in pieces. Us both. Anyway, let's get this power sitch sorted. Guys, we're going to do another test. I love a good ray trace test. Or, okay, we'll do ray trace, then we'll even take a look at this one. It's a uh, really crazy one. Alright, so we got 30 frames. It's going to turn it into 70 frames here in a second. Boom. I don't know why it takes a second to do that, but it does. So that looks pretty good. But then... We take it another step forward. Path tracing. Boom. Hit me with it. Boom. Uh, I don't think we need that though. Only for creating single frame change. Okay. So we do that. Boom. There's a uh, ray reconstruction. Bang. Check this out. Two frames a second, baby. Hang on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Damn it. Actually, it's probably the frame generation that that's what um, is like waiting for it to catch up. This also could be it, though. <laughs> Who is running this? Frame gem was probably disabled. Oh, 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 oh. Frame gem was probably disabled. Okay. Now it's there. I hit 25 frames for a second. Oh, maybe I just need to hit escape. We're at 50 now. Wow. That does look really good, not gonna lie. We're in it, though. Isn't that crazy? Whoa. We're in path tracing technology. Yeah. 
And then DLAA, is that even like worth it? Like what's the difference between that and then DLSS? There you go. Tight circles. Look at that. God, that's smooth, huh? Ooh. That's wicked smooth. And it still looks pretty damn good. DLA is uh, NVIDIA's version of TAA. It's Yeah, but, but like, why can I not have DLSS while DLAA is on? It's weird how all that stuff like worked. Did you guys like notice that the path trace took like 45 seconds to start slash me hitting the escape button for a second? All good in there? Yes, I know how to change clothes, V. Just because I haven't had to for 12 years. You've been present for 12 years? <laughs> Should do the trick by my eye. Really? This thing's gonna power the whole. DLSS is super sampling where you're. Internal resolution is lower, like 720p, and is upscale with NVIDIA tech. Is that true? It's not true. I yeah, I want to look into DLSS more. I like kind of talked about it in The Witcher, but it was uh, or maybe I, yeah, I did, I did, because I looked into it, looked into it, but not that much. I did for something. I forgot what it was. Anyway, I think it was ray tracing. Ray tracing, I did a whole thing on. DLSS includes some element of DLA. It takes a low res image and upscales it. Uh, including trying to fix the jaggedness. DLA operates at full resolution for the frame post processing. We had that super beefed 4K computer struggle to run games, but a PS4 sometimes can run the game fine. Yeah, that's a rare, rare, rare occasion. It's almost like the, uh, it, Mark, what you're thinking is almost like the opposite, I feel like. I mean, I could be wrong. You, you're probably right in your own way, or with your own examples. But the, um, the, I feel like it's also like, like, console, oh, wait, what was I just going to say? I was going to say that PC games sometimes just get a terrible port, and then they're like, fucked. But most, most of the time, it's like if a game's released on console and PC, most of the time it will run better on PC. I don't even know. What am I saying? Who cares? The, uh, <laughs> I don't even know how to use graphic settings anymore in case 3 million options and I understand none of it. GPU. My eyes changing clothes. You said 47 GPU. I have a 4070 Ti. i7-13700K and a 4070 Ti is what I have. Use a special hardware in the GPU to accelerate the upscaling process and real-time DLSS and FSR both reduce internal resolution and then upscale. Whether you choose dictates what internal resolution is. Because I've seen <clears throat> I've seen DLSS fuck me over in like perform uh using performance mode of it, because it looks lower res, like a lot. Um, but anything on quality looks fine. DLSS performance at 4K reduces its internal resolution to 1080p. Okay, that makes more sense. So if you run a game at 1440p with DLSS performance, it's running at like 640p and upscaling. It does an amazing job. Performance runs at like 1080p. Yeah, exactly. It's really, really wild. I don't get it though. It's like... Like, it, I would imagine that process would be like so taxing. And so latency affecting. It doesn't? 
My 3080 is a Founders Edition. Was a crypto miner card. Someone paid 2,200 for. I paid him 500 for it. When? Holy hell, no, man. Lucky son of a bitch. Yeah, it's interesting stuff. Like, I want to see what what. All right, so like we're looking around right now. It's we're looking around right now. Okay, let's go in this room. Got like 150 frames, right here. That's where we were at. Um, but if I did DLAA, so that always turns it off. DLAA and sharpness. It's like what? How? What is this? 80 again? I guess. Frame generation still on. No ray tracing. And now we're gonna probably give it a second because frame generation, whatever. Smooth. So this is like a 40 frame drop. It's at 104, 120 frames now. Sorry, I was jumping around a little bit. And it's like, is DLAA better than... Because when I was using DLAA, it was like not... Like, it was rougher. And I'm wondering, like, this is probably going to add to the frame generation, which adds to my input lag. Oh my god, how am I still streaming? I got the will. The will to survive. I should wrap it up here soon, though. I'm being inclusion. Local shadows use up too much performance and don't add much, in my opinion. I know. Yeah. See, that's that's the other thing that um, it's like putting ambient occlusion at medium or something like that. Like gets like 13% performance back or something like crazy. And that still looks fucking great. So I'm doing that. It's like that volumetric fog and then like uh, screen space reflections or something. Like those three settings together can like like dump 40% of your performance. It's cool to see how far 7.27.7 has come. I know. It's really it really is amazing. Like I I have I mean, look at this fucking room that we're in right now. Like, look at how many shit. Look at how much shit is modeled for this random ass room that we're in. Like, even this whole generator. Like, just there's so much detail in everything in this game. Like, I, I truly, one of the things I wanted to talk about was just driving around Night City, in, in the in the YouTube video. Just driving around Night City. Like, I constantly drive around Night City, just like in awe. It's amazing. <sighs> All right, we'll call it there. I'm done, boys. Let's do, um, what do you think I should do? DLSS or DLAA? I lost 20 frames doing it. I think DLSS, because the 3.5 thing came out or whatever. Yeah, it's clearly today's can we run it crisis game. For sure. Yeah, that's exactly what this is. Yeah. Dude, I remember when crisis came out, I literally was like this. The graphics can't look better. What? I don't get it. Graphics cannot look better. And now they look absurd. Balanced your performance mode. See, a lot of people are saying quality, though. All right. Now, we'll, we'll use quality. We're at 150 frames. I think we're fine. Alright, uh, uh, so tired. Actually, I'm not so tired, but I'm, I'm losing my energy, and I do gotta go to bed. The Alan Wake 2 comes out and is more demanding than this game. Are you fucking kidding me? What, because of all the flashlights? So much ray tracing coming out of them flashlights. Try turning off local shadows, though, I swear it makes a difference. Are you talking about contact shadows? Local shadows. We'll see. We'll see. I looked. I look up. Look up. Um, look up. Uh, a guy named Benchmark King, but like Benchmark King, Benchmark King, 
on YouTube, his breakdown of Phantom Liberty is like graphic settings. It's like super in depth. And there's so many settings. I don't get why games do this. There's so many settings that like change fucking virtually nothing. But then like you get like 4%. Well, actually, no, no, it's not even that. There's so many settings that just don't do anything straight up. No performance gain, no performance, whatever. It's like they just don't do anything. All right. I will see you outrun high. Uh, <laughs> stay away. Just woke up at 7 a.m. here. I will be uh probably tomorrow. And we'll keep on going. And, and I'll be more into the game and less uh, talking for two hours before it starts. Oh, and how we do it? Donate $2 through the Super Chat. My wife agrees our baby shouldn't go to college. And on that note, <laughs> I'll see you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for all the donations. And uh, yeah, it's crazy that you guys, I don't know, are here to support me. I appreciate it very much. You are the best. And catch me next time on Cyberpunk 2077, Phantom Liberty. I'm literally like, my brain is like shutting down and I'm just talking nonsense now. All right, I'll see you guys.